All right, you ready to start this? We're doing this granny style. Yeah, granny. Let's invite rest of TikTok on over. And then we are going to get going. Let's go live. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. We're going to do that. And we are going to do this. Hello, TikTok. Hello. Are you ready for some granny? I'm ready. I'm ready. Ready, 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 ready. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, Paige. Hello, Presley's mom. All right, how is everybody? We are, we're just jumping right in with some granny today. I feel like, I feel like, uh, hello, Laura. I feel like uh, I'm doing good. I feel like, uh, I don't know if I feel like being chased or if I feel like, um, I don't know. Hopefully I get the, the weapon here soon and I can, I can just be like, there you go. Gino, how are you? Um, Paige is so happy I have the house myself tonight and I'm so excited to snuggle in and watch your live. Awesome. We are going to have a great live today. We are just going to do things. We're going to have a good, oh shoot. I saw her. I saw her. I saw her out of the corner of my eye. Oh no. Oh no. I pushed the wrong button. She's hot on my tail. Oh no, get out, get out, get out. Ah, hello, Shannon. What's in line for today? Well, today I think we are going to do kind of like what we did yesterday. Well, no, yesterday we started off with a, a spot the difference game. So I think tonight we are going to start with Granny and then do some more phasmobia because I'm all about my ghost hunting. Um, Rose, thank you for hurting me. Gino, thank you for hurting me. And OG, thank you for my Rose. So I am all about um, phasmophobia these days. I have just been enjoying playing that so much. And I thought we would do some more ghost hunting. And then I would really like to... I would really like to um, keep working on In Sound Mind. Hello. Um, <laughs> that's right. I'm here to make your day, Gino. Let's make this a good day. Oh, no, Brandy, you're stuck in traffic. Did you start earlier today? No, I've only been on for two minutes, and I usually start right at 3.30. So I'm actually a couple of minutes late today. So... I will hold my head in shame because I am a couple of minutes late. Hello, Trina. Yeah, I, th am, I thought that this was going to be really good. Hello, Matt. Phasmophobia is more puzzle than you, I realized. I enjoy watching you play it. You know what, OG? I really do like that. Um, um, Lonnie, tell me why I waited in Panera drive through for 30 minutes. I don't know because Panera is really good. Uh, I actually really enjoy playing that just for the simple reason that we can work on things like this together. And I feel like even though I'm ghost hunting all on my own, I feel like we're a little team effort. And I really like that. This game seems really loud. Let me do something really quick. Oh, do I want to... No, but hold on here just a sec. I want to adjust one volume. Okay. And let's bring you back. Okay. Awesome. Uh, Caitlin, I am doing good. Um, yeah, I don't know why. It's um, TikTok. I mean... I'm not too sure what's going on. It's been a little glitchy lately. Um, I just think it's having like seasonal depression. <laughs> I don't know. Oop, there she is. TikTok's been a little weird for me too. I'm doing well. Doing, doing, doing good. So let me ask you this. 
Um, what looks colorless? Hello, Lonnie. Um, you are very welcome. Yeah, it is. There definitely are. What kind of music, music do I listen to? Okay, I do have one question. Um, I want to make sure the game is not too loud compared to um, my microphone. So is, my, is the game louder than it should be? Because to me, it seems like the game is very loud today for some reason. And I want to make sure that it's not too, your mic is louder. Okay. Okay, good. Just making sure. Because today when I went to log on and the reason, um, Allison, thank you for hearting me. Thank you for my cheers. And Trina, thank you for my rose. And one of the reasons why I was a little, um, I was a little late today is uh, there was another update for TikTok. And every time I go to jump on, it's like, we've just upgraded our system. And I'm like, ah. So anyway, I'm going to blame TikTok because that sounds like the thing to do. Amber, I have been looking forward to our lives also. And I tried to get some new games today. And I, um, thank you. I actually, this is my gray hair and tattoo sweatshirt. Uh, this is my, this is actually my, this is my stuff. I have, I do have merchandise uh, for gray hair and tattoo. I, it's, uh, but I'm working on the merchandise for our bean team. So anyway, what I was saying is, what was I saying? I don't even remember what I was saying. Um, the game does seem a little quiet. She's in her shy era. See, I was thinking it was a little loud. I don't know. I got, oh, new games. That's right. So I tried to find some new games because I wanted to mix things up a little bit. And um, I got that Endless Suburbia, the one where I drive around and Literally, I drove and I drove and I drove, and you know that I don't drive very well on video games, but I wanted to test it out just in case it was going to be fun, and I drove and I drove and I drove and nothing happened, and I was so bummed, uh, and I was just so you know what? It's, it's, I don't even know. I mean, maybe, maybe I didn't give it enough of a, um, enough of a try. I, and I was actually driving pretty well. I was really surprised. I was, I was giving myself two thumbs up for driving, but I just couldn't find anything. Um, I couldn't find anything. And it was the endless suburbia. And I've had you all recommend that a couple of times and I was like maybe I'm driving in the wrong area um Gavin I think it is and I think there's like different neighborhoods you can drive through one of them has aliens one of them has spiders but the the neighborhood I was driving through had zero nothing hello dancing queen so my question to you right off this morning or this evening is, have you watched anybody else play it? I mean, is it worth me to keep driving? Um, so I'm not too sure. Um, hold on here. Hold, please. Do, do, do. Sound check. The bean merchandise, um, I am actively, actively working on that. And hopefully I will, um, hopefully I will have that out. Hold on, I want to see something. Hold on, please. Um, the game does seem a little quiet, okay. Hello, cheese. Um, okay, okay, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, Brandy. 
during the day are you on youtube or more tiktok um i am on okay yeah elizabeth that's exactly what i'm checking um uh, hello betsy okay <laughs> it's funny you and i were checking the exact same thing um i uh, oh anyway if you've seen anybody else play endless suburbia and you for sure think it's a good game and that it's like a an interesting game to watch please let me know because like i said what i saw was just a bunch of e run 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 a bunch of very um i don't drive well but i was blasting through all the stop signs just because there was nothing there um hello Sheb, how are you i think you should play it okay once things start happening okay well maybe we can do a, a little drive through once we're here at granny's maybe we'll give it a go Lenny, what kind of music do you listen to? Um, you were answering, but stopped. Oh, sorry, my friend. I have a very wide range of musical tastes. And I will say I go anywhere from Johnny Cash to, um, to Miley Cyrus. I love, I love a whole lot of music. And I know that that sometimes seems like a kind of a cop out because, you know, I can't put my finger on just one. I can't put my finger just on one thing. Hello, Barb. Danny, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate that. Barb, thank you for hearting me. And Presley's mom, thank you for hearting me. Um, yeah, I mean, and here's the thing. It's, it's like I just recently became a huge Miley Cyrus fan. <gasps> Barb, thank you for my ducks on parade. There is a duck on parade. But um, ever, I, I don't know. I just recently stumbled upon like how incredibly awesome she is. And so I've been all fixated on Miley Cyrus. Um, mine is the one that, and I, the one that she talks about how she used to be young and how they used to say she was crazy, but you know, but it was just because she used to be young. That one reminds me a lot of myself because when I was not sober, I did a lot of wild things. And it's not that I was wild. It's just, you know, I'm just a dear. It's not that I'm not it is adventurous and I'm not as fun, but I'm just, I, I think I'm a little bit more settled in. Oh, shit. She's right there, too. She got me. I thought I could sneak by her. Used to be young is a good one. Yeah, I really do like that song. Hi, Ellie. How are you? Um, yes. And, and a lot of it is, what granny is this? It reminds me of granny one. Wise girl, it is granny one. This is my favorite. I was actually, um, I was actually playing granny remake, but that is like, I am going to have to get used to that one before I play it on here because it's got a, it's a little different for sure. So I am learning that when I come back to life, she does not move that much. So I have been running back into her um, way too often. Okay, number two, everybody. Remember the number two. So when we go down to Spider Central, I'll know what box to open up. But after we're done here, if you want, we can we can try that driving game. And I'll definitely give it a go. I mean, if nothing else, it's hilarious just watching me drive that game. Do I like Lana Del Rey? You know, I'll be completely honest. I don't think I couldn't name one song that she sang. So um, I'm not 100% sure. I, I might, but I'm just not sure. Used to be young is a masterpiece, absolutely. And I think also to EMT, thank you for my high bear. And again, Barb, thank you for my duck on parade. And I think one of the reasons why I gravitate to her so much now more than I used to, it's just because, I mean, she's sober also. So it, it I think it's like the, I can connect with her a little bit more, I think. So anyway, she's my new favorite um, artist that I listen to on repeat. 
Oh, so true. You tried to play those who remain. It had a heart pounding at the start that scared me. <gasps> oh, okay. Only Cats Matter. It's called Endless Suburbia. And I've heard it was scary, but I don't know. Maybe if I just play it more, I'll get out of the neighborhood. Um, and here's the thing. Oh, my gosh. I have got to remember the things I was going to start saying. I've just been starting like four different sentences, and I have not stopped them. And I haven't finished them. I don't know. You like? Well, I actually like listening to my... I love telling stories. I love talking. And I think... I know myself when I got sober, it was kind of like a, I had a moment of reflection of why me, you know, why did I have to go through all of that? Why did my life have to be so ugly? And it was at that moment that I realized that I had stories to share with others that might help somebody else. And that's one of the reasons why I enjoy, I enjoy sharing my stories so much is because, you know, um, because it just might help somebody. And to me, it's always worth it. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, she actually got a bath today. I gave Indy a bath. It wasn't super warm, but I needed to give her a bath because she has such bad skin problems. And I can't get behind on her, um, on her bath. So she did a really good job. She jumped in. And um, did she end up getting out of the rain? Oh, yeah, my dog, um, did she ever end up going into the rain is the question. But she definitely, hello, Alicia. Um, yeah, Lonnie. Okay, so here's the thing, and I'm going to tell you right now that I found with Indy, and it might help with your dogs also, but she's allergic to chicken, and chicken is in so many different dog products that I have to be super careful with what I get her just for that reason. So if your dog has bad allergies, maybe um, think about getting rid of chicken. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, true. I, this was the first time I ever, usually she's like, nah, mom, I'm good. But the bath and the shampoo that I'm using must really work well because she was like as soon as I turned on the bathtub she was right there and she's like yeah let's get into the bath she is everywhere tonight Jamie I had to buy a sticky thing to put peanut butter on to get her even close to the tub For some reason today Indy was just like you know what I'm just gonna hang out with mom and whatever she tells me to do I'm gonna do it oh no I'll use this. I just don't know how to. I was going to pepper spray her. I don't know how to use this, but I was going to do it. Um, yeah, so that's absolutely the one thing that I would probably look into if, you're, if your pup is having um, any sort of allergy problem is look into like maybe um, taking chicken out of their diet. It worked really well for Indy. Every once in a while, I have to go get her an allergy shot. But other than that, usually just taking that out of her diet has helped a lot. Doo -doo. I line the tub with treats. She's very treat motivated. Oh, that's a really good one. Ha, Elizabeth, you know I was going to spray myself. I always freeze myself in the trap. Um, why would I not just do that? No, this is, uh, this is called granny. We're going to play phasmophobia later. We're going to kind of mix it up a little bit tonight. Tonight, we're going to mix it up. Tonight, we're going to do our thing. Tonight, it's all about, we're going to sing tonight. <laughs> not one of my finer moments. But it was a it was a character building moment when I froze myself in that freezer trap. That's the way I like at it. Ooh, you've been playing Pokemon Emerald. How cool. We are starting off with Granny. I was in kind of a mood where I felt like I wanted to just, I don't know, not that I want to, you know, cause chaos, but I was I was in a little bit more of a 
I don't know, maybe a talkative mood because a lot of times certain games I play is very hard for me to play and talk. And I thought today would be a fun day to, ah, run, Lonnie, run, to just kind of hang out and talk a little bit in the beginning. Uh, I am back, love of crypto. Ah, oh, thank you for my roses. I appreciate that. And hello, Marissa. I do need to make a best of granny. You know what? That's just the thing is, is like I was listening to Robert and he's on Twitch. And the cool thing is, is that when we get over there, you all can actually clip cuts from the stream and, um, and we can post those. So that will be fun too. Hello, Alyssa. Oh, on Friday, I'm going to start telling you all now on Friday, I might be a little late to the stream uh, because, oh, Granny is definitely the bad, bad one, bad person. Um, I have to go to LA to, I actually have a meeting with TikTok in LA on Friday. So I should be on time, but just in case I'm not, um, I will I will get here as soon as I can. Um, is it 8 a.m. where you are? Oh, Gina, you're talking to Elizabeth. Yeah, yeah, I'm really, I'm actually really excited about it. So, yeah. I don't think they're gonna, I don't think I'm gonna get any food, but it's just, it's just an, I, I'm just gonna sit down with them for an hour, but yeah, no, it's, it's about a, it's about a two hour drive for a one hour meeting and then a two hour drive back. So I don't plan on being late, but if I am, that is why. So if I'm late, we're gonna blame TikTok. Yeah, I, I'm really super excited about that. I, yeah, I'll just be lingering around and I'll be like, hey, is there anything you wanna send with me on the road? I think the traffic is going to be a little bit harder going there in the morning than it's going to be coming back. Thank you. Yeah, I was just sitting here looking and I think I needed a little bit of a redder lip. And then I have a thing called a fast pass that because I don't go into Orange County or LA very often. But when I do, I can use it's like paying for carpool kind of. So I will definitely utilize that and try to expedite my journey home yeah cuz um, you'll be driving with all the people going to work and taking their kids to school yeah and you know what truthfully one of the worst place for traffic I don't know if you're all familiar with California but um, the 91 and Corona is just brutal yeah yep and so um, but yeah, no, it's definitely going to be fun. And I was thinking about it and I was like, what am I going to wear? You know what? I'm going to wear exactly what I want to wear. I'm just going to wear my, my cool jeans, my Doc Martens and maybe a cool jacket. And you know what? That's what I'm going to wear. They're not there to judge my fashion sense. So I just want to be super comfortable. I just want to be super comfortable. I've heard it's a nightmare. I have a cousin who lives in LA. Yeah, 91. Oh my gosh, it is such a nightmare. But like I said, I have that um, fast pass thing and I don't use it very often. So I'm definitely going to be utilizing that. Ooh, the snoozy. Yeah, you know what? That might, I'm either going to wear that one or I have that really cute kind of like, it almost looks like a pink bomber, even though it's not pink, it's like red cream and blue. Oh, shit. She got me. <sighs> Tis, yeah. Yeah, I definitely am trying to incorporate some new games in. Um, we're going to be doing one here shortly. I did a new game yesterday also. Will you do? Oh, yeah, Gavin, you know what I, I what I was going to do is I was going to include that in my outfit for the day. I was just going to show the outfit, mm -hmm. show the trip, kind of talk about the meeting. A little bit and then um, uh, and I was just going to kind of incorporate that into my outfit of the day all right so I'm chit-chatting it up and oh no there she is 
and I have to be more careful. I need to stop chit-chatting so much. I need to stop chit-chatting so much. Um, are we playing Phasma tonight? Yes, yes, uh, yes. I'm obsessed with that game. I, oh, there she is right there. I really do like that game. And sometimes, okay, I don't know if you all do the same thing. Oh, shit, she's right behind me. How did she get out there? How did she get out there so fast? Oh, my God, that scared me. I had no idea that she could get out there. She must have jumped out the window right after me. Crazy lady. <sighs> yeah. I mean, I know that she goes outside, but I thought she had to, like, um, I thought she would have to, like, walk around and go out the door. That scared me, everybody. I guess I can drop my key now. Eee. Um, she is everywhere tonight. Thank you, Bella. I know I do need, okay, Barb, I do, I do, and I apologize. I need to make a hugging emote. I want a little bean that gives a hug, and I want to do a, um, I want to do a ghost one. So we're going to do a ghost bean emote, and we're going to do a hugging one. Because every once in a while, I need a hug. And every once in a while, one of you all need a hug. And I want to be able to do that. And I think that that would be cute. I think that that would be what we need to do. Let's see if we can see her. Yeah, I really like that. You know, I mean, we have such a cool community. And we're so supportive of one another. I just want, you know, I want to be able to, to do that. That's what I was looking for. Good goodness gracious. Oh, there she is. She's setting traps everywhere. Run, Lonnie, run. Run, Lonnie, run. Go get this out of the microwave. Run, Lonnie, run. Ah, run, Lonnie. Oh, no. Phew. That made me sweat. I don't know if you can see it or not, um, but that just made me sweat. <laughs> Shoot. All right, everybody, if you're scared of big spiders or tight spots, this one's not, you're not going to like this one. Did they say anything about what the topic of the, yeah, it's just, um, it's just, um, they want to have an interview just about my thought process of creating on TikTok. So... It's just kind of like, um, you know, they just kind of like a little Q&A for creators. A little Q&A for creators. Yeah, I know. I'm like, that's so exciting. They, it, it, to me, every time they send me an email or something like that, I'm always like, gosh, they know who I am. And it just, it's, sometimes it's a little cool. It's a little overwhelming. Hello, Sharon. I said happy birthday to Wally. I don't know if you saw my, my response. I'm so over this spider lady. All right, everybody, remember to drink your water. Thank you, Gavin. I think yesterday I did not drink enough water because I woke up with a little headache and I definitely think it was like a little dehydration. So I'm going to be calling out for more hydration breaks today. So just letting you know, you got to get your water because we're going to be using that. Because it's all about the hydration stations. Okay, I definitely need this. Scary, scary. Oh my gosh. Ugh! I barely got by her. Did you see that? Got yours and ready? Awesome. Oh my gosh. Oh, and Granny's right there. 
Oh, good gold snooker. I am so glad you got that. Look it. I. Oh my God. Oh, no, no, no. I had no idea she could whack a mole me through that little hole in the wall. Nope, 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 no. And I went back there to show you Granny right there too. Ugh. Okay, at the end of the night, we're going to play another round of Granny because I refuse to suck as bad at this game. Because I really doubt if we get out tonight, considering how absolutely brutal she is being. Ah, Melissa. Melissa, thank you for the subscription. I appreciate you immensely. I would like to welcome you to the Bean family. We're loving, we're caring, and we're always here. Thank you for being Bean number 1,691. Thank you, Melissa, for subscribing. And Jen, thank you for my corgi. I love my corgis. We have a new bean. I got my butt kicked by a spider, but we got a new bean. New bean Tuesday. Oh, what's today? Wednesday. No, today's Tuesday, huh? New bean Tuesday. New bean Tuesday. Ah, uh, run, Lonnie, run. Slide in there. Go, go, go. Oh, look, she's sticking her little legs in here. That's gross. She was sticking her legs in there. She was like, I'm going to get you. Bean, bean, the magical fruit. Except we just don't make each other fart. At least I hope not. All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, so what was the number that we saw up there? Was it number two? Is that the number I called out? I don't remember. Um, number two. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> oh, no. Stop. I don't want to go back down. I pushed the wrong button. Stephanie, thank you for my rose. And Christy, thank you for my cheers. We're just going to go up and down the elevator. Um, you know, Jen, I am of the age where not much stops me. All right, let's go see what's in the safe. Lonnie, I have some very sad news. I ran out of Uncrustables. No! Okay, emergency Uncrustable meeting. We need to stock up more. How was last night's stream? I had to leave early. It was good. You know what? It was a really fun stream. I had a lot of, I had a lot of fun. We played really good games. And, um, and, oh, no. Oh, 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 run, run, Lonnie, run. Where am I? Oh, gee, many crickets. I almost went right in there. I'm so lost. I don't know where I'm at. Here I am. Okay. Whew. Oh, I can't believe I made it up. It was a lot of fun. So I have my, um, my dinner already. I have my Uncrustable and my cookies. So I'm all packed in. I have a strawberry. The strawberry ones were really good. I actually, I don't think I have met an Uncrustable that I don't like yet. So I say any flavor is good. There she is. Okay. Something's up with her, man. Doo -doo. You're getting more tomorrow. Awesome. Actually, you know what I was thinking about doing is um, Fun Dipper. Thank you so much for um, switching your subscription to an auto subscription. Thank you. Fun Dipper for doing that. 
Thank you, Fun Dipper, for doing that. Um, I was thinking about emailing schmuckers and telling them about our stream and our Uncrustable obsession and see if they wouldn't like sponsor us and maybe get us some free Uncrustables. I think that that would be fun where I could like uh, raffle off Uncrustables. Um, I don't know if that's something they would find fun, but I think it would be fun. And I think I could talk them into it. Because I could pretty much talk in, well, I wouldn't say I could talk anybody into anything, but I can talk, I think I could talk them into it. Yeah, well, free people, you know what, the only time, okay, I've been wearing free people now for a really long time, and I've been promoting their clothes for a very long time, and the only post that they have ever responded to was the one that had Indy in it. So, they're like, oh, you have such a cute dog, and I'm like, how about giving me some free clothes? So... But I had to agree with them. Indy is very cute. So could not argue with that. All right, let's see where she's at. Scary, scary, scary. Do you think she's up here? Oh, you work for Urban Outfitters. Oh, very cool. I actually have um, a couple of things that I really like from Urban Outfitters. In fact, the jacket that I wore today, that's from Urban Outfitters. Oh, you're a photo retoucher. Very cool. Um, <laughs> you know what? I was going to say, we could do a refried bean um, uncrustable. Uh, ooh, that actually sounds pretty cool, but we could do it with like a tortilla. And then we would have like a little uncrustable bean um, burrito. There's no way she knows that I'm in here. There's no way. Doesn't that sound interesting? She is right outside the closet. Um, I'm not in the hand. Yeah, I, well, you know what, truthfully, I just appreciate you being here as an individual. Um, yeah, something like that, wise girl. Exactly. I'm manifesting a free people sponsorship for you in the near future. Well, thank you, Jen. Um, I would be happy with Smuckers. Um, it's basically what you have for breakfast as a Mexican. I love it. Yeah, I was about to say with a tortilla, though. That's what I was thinking. I'm not too sure how um, bread and refried beans would work out, but, you know, I love um, I love a good fried egg, refried beans, and a tortilla. So, I mean, it does... It, I don't think it would be bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got stuff littered all over the place. Okay, we need one more for one more day. And what do I want to do? Oh, there she is again. All right, so let's go ahead and run up. I'm thinking, unfortunately, we need to go back down to Spider Cities. <gasps> Grilled cheese, you know what? I think that that would be amazing, but on something like that, it would almost be where you would have to cook it because otherwise it would just be a cheese. I mean, I don't know. I'm trying to think. As a kid, I think I ate cheese sandwiches. I mean, seriously, we did, we had no money as a kid when I was a kid, so pretty much anything my mom put in front of me, I ate. They came pre-toasted. That's suspicious. I'm not really too sure what I would think about that. For one thing, you know, it would still be, it would still be cold, and I want my grilled cheese sandwich to be hot. So I don't know. I would have, I'm going to have to give that one a firm maybe. Okay. All right, going back down. We are playing Granny right at the moment. Hello, Ruby. They got continued, discontinued in 2014. Yeah, you know what? I just think that that's the uncrust. I could see that one being the uncrustable that never took off. See, I, again, suspicious. I would think more like a toaster. I would retoast my toasted bread. I don't know. I just, it's just not, it's not wowing me. Damn, there's nothing under here. I was waiting for her to pop up. Huh. 
huh? She gonna be right there? Hmm. Ah, thank you, Seren. I appreciate that. Hello, Tyler. How are you? Gavin, I just look for they have a tendency to to hide like a lot of the keys down here. And this particular game, there's just there's just nothing down here. Because I need a shotgun. I need a piece of the shotgun to Oh. That was weird. I've never found the That was weird. Ah, maybe I'm tripping now. I don't have a hammer. <gasps> Yum. Okay. Sam just said um, she took a uncrustable, a Nutella one, toasted it, and then put strawberries in it. And I think that sounds amazing. Hello, Veronica. So after we're done playing this one, we are going to head over and we're going to test out uh, Endless Suburbia just to see if we can't make that fun. Like I said, I played it and it was a lot of me driving around, but we all know how poorly I drive. So that should be interesting. And then we'll just kind of have like a fun time from there. There's a piece of the shotgun, so let's get this back down to the garage. Let's see if we can't get that down here. Is that the last piece of the shotgun that I need? That would be super swell if it is. Super swell. Oh, it was. All right, let's go get her. If nothing else, I just want to pew pew her. Um, hello, hello, hello again, everybody. I have you, have you ever went camping and made a mountain pie with cherries or other fruits? No. I mean, I've gone camping, but I've never made anything that sound like that. But it sounds, if you let me know what it is, maybe I made it in a different and called it something else. Um... Ooh, you added bananas. Also a 10 out of a 10. Yeah, I could see that. Um, that does sound good. Hello, Linz. How are you? Thank you for popping in and saying hello. I appreciate you for doing that. Okay, I think I found the spider key down in the spider area, but let's see what's in here first. Let's see what's in here first. Ah, ah. Okay, that's definitely going to bring her down here. Ooh, the hammer. That's pretty cool. I'll take that all day long. And there she is. Let's go hide. Okay. All right. Ooh, I was thinking a crustable banana would be good. Yes. Ooh, you know what? I have an crustable, the hazelnut one, and I have a banana over there. Maybe I will take a break and I will, Siren, thank you so much for the follow, and I will toast it up and have it with a banana, and then I'll let you know how it is. I think I will. I'm going to go crazy. I'm just going to go crazy tonight. That's it. Consider that one done. That's what I'm going to do because you know what? We just live on the edge here. We just live on the edge. Have you put it in the air fryer? Sierra, unfortunately, my air fryer is kind of acting up and it's just, it's not, it's not air frying. Um, <laughs> yes, wise girl, you are. It is life-changing. Awesome. I'm so looking forward to that. Like I said, it's already unfrosted, so it's a little bit too early yet. I think the air fryer is super good. Um, how do you do full screen? I've never seen that before. You just turn it sideways. Um, 
Everybody who turns, who watches it full screen, is there a button that Grace needs to turn? Or to, do you just turn it? Or do you have to like authorize something? If, if anybody knows if you could put that up, that would be awesome. Could you please put that up? There's a little button um, or you can turn it. Okay, thank you, Gavin. Okay, Danny says, yes, it looks like brackets on the side of the screen. Okay, cool. Awesome. Awesome. We have the best community on TikTok. I I would I would thumb wrestle because I can't say the word that I want to use. Any other content creator here on TikTok, um, and if they ever said they had a better uh, live, better community than I did, that's what I'm trying to say. Jiminy crickets, I can't talk. <gasps> Shanita, how are you, my friend? Shanita's in the house. I love me some Shanita when she's in the house. What did you have for dinner tonight, Shanita? I'm having Uncrustables. I'm going to toast this with a banana. With a banana. I, I always keep my um, portrait orientation locked so I can use the side button to go full screen. Oh, that's really cool, Gavin. That's really cool. You know what? I do love bananas, too. I have been loving bananas. Hello, Lucky Tay. How are you? Look at her bat is all like has remnants of my, of her assaulting me. Um, yep, she's in the house. Banana ice cream is so good. You know what? I don't think I've ever had banana ice cream, but I've had banana pudding. Joanne, I love you too. Thank you. Um, do, do, do. All right, let's get going here. Let's get going in the house. We're going to take this little sucker upstairs and see if we can't find anything up there. Let's go see what we got over here. Let's go see what we got over here. Lucky Tay, this is Granny, the first one, and we're going to play this uh, for a while, or as soon as I, as soon as my five days are up, we're going to try something else, and then we're going to try Endless Suburbia, which is a game that I drive around neighborhoods. I've heard it's scary. I tried it today, um, and... I absolutely love that one. My favorite childhood movie. Um, I would have to say, <sighs> I loved everything scary, and I really loved um, The Haunting of Hill House when I was a kid. I've always loved scary, scary movies and books. And I mean, other than that, I really liked like Disney cartoons and stuff like that. But as far as movies, I would definitely say probably The Haunting of Hill House, like the old black and the old black and white one. E.T., yeah. I remember seeing that in the movie theaters with my mom. Uh, scary is my favorite. Okay, Lucy, thank you so much for hearting me. And Aaron, thank you for hearting me. <gasps> okay, we found the watermelon. So we got a little bit more going on. So let's put this full of gas. Um, no, Tiffany, that's such a long game. We have so much more to do. The, we, we still have three more tapes to do. So that's going to be a... Oh, shit. I, oh, yeah, you know what? I have seen the Netflix ones. I've seen, um, I've seen them both. I think I like the first one best. Yes, we're doing phasmophobia today. Lily, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate that. I don't know, Gavin. She's just been all up in my business today. Hello, Lily. I have not enjoyed her. Um, I have not enjoyed her company today at all. So since I know she's down there, 
let's go ahead and no I don't so let's see where she went because I know she was down in the garage the first one was so good it made me cry so much yeah you know what it was so 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 good um, but I mean I you know that's just the whole thing it's it's like I can remember like I said as a kid just watching scary movie after scary movie and just I couldn't get enough of it um <laughs> you know what Sam I definitely think I I definitely think she's got it in for me and I really think that she's like sometimes I think that she just figures out my routine and she's just waiting for me she's like yep I know where she's gonna be uh because I want this watermelon, but I also know she's going to probably come down now. So we'll wait and see. Um, I had to hop off previous streams not too long ago. Did you try playing a card, uh, a game called Silver Chain? No, Linz, I didn't, but I will write that down. I will write that down. Okay, Bluegrass, we will be here. Silver Chains. Got it. Ooh, strawberry water sounds good. Okay, I'll take a look at it. If it's not the right one, I'll let you know. Oh, silver change is fun. It's the right one, yeah. Very cool. I'm always looking for new games. I have another one that I'm testing out. It's a lot like Phasmophobia, but on this one, you have to like actually figure out the ghost's story before um, to figure it out. I mean, it's not so much like what kind of ghost, but why is the ghost haunting the place? And I, I'm not 100% sure I'm sold on that one yet. A spark plug. So I will continue playing that one to see if I like it or not. Um, no, Gino, I haven't seen that one. Yeah, it was an interesting concept, but the problem is, wise girl, and here's where I'm really kind of struggling with it, is a lot of times with those kind of content, they make the ghost's story really traumatic. And I have to figure out whether or not that's a, a game that I find enjoyable and if I want to play it. So it's like sometimes it's such a catch-22 because, I mean, I don't particularly want to hear something about, like, DA or, you know, like, any sort of, like, substance abuse. And it seems like a lot of those goats had the same trauma that I had. So I have to be really careful about that. And so that's why I wanted to play it a little bit and kind of um, fill it out and then see about that. Okay, everybody, if I were a shotgun, does anybody remember? Oh, I remember where I put it. I put it right here. I was going to say, does anybody remember where I put my shotgun? Devour? No. Is that a good one, Bluegrass? Yeah, and you know what? And that's just the thing. If, if I don't enjoy it, you know, chances are you're not going to enjoy it. And for me, I just, you know, I just don't think every single, I don't think every single ghost had a substance abuse problem i don't know i think there's some i think there's some ghosts out there that perhaps were sober when they passed away that still turned into ghosts you know maybe that maybe that's my misconception um to do i have ghost exorcism inc and it's like phasma but also ex oh okay that sounds interesting. I love how that sounds when it falls. I love how that sounds when it falls. I love how that sounds when it falls. Okay, so she's already gone. So let's take this down here. Ah! Ah! Um, 11,000 already. Awesome. Good job, everybody. 
Thank you for all those tippy taps. I appreciate you so, 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 so much. Thank you, everybody. Um, oh, ghost watchers. Okay, let me write that one down. Ah, let me write that one down. Ghost watchers. There are three amnesia games and then there's one game oh wow if i had the wrench if i had the wrench i think i could get out pick that up um i either need the master key or the wrench you know what i mean jelly beans because i have the spark plug I just can't do anything. Were you able to check out the um, Out Death's Door game? Not scary, but it's cute. And I, you know what? I did check that one out. Okay, so there are three amnesias. The first, I will check out that one. I think I checked it out. I have a big old long list that I have, I have my notes on. So I will definitely look and see if I looked into that one. But there are three three amnesia games the one that we played and then there's one um the second one i have not heard very good reviews on the second one and then the first one is amnesia um uh, what's that one called amnesia dark descent heard that one is very good and we will be playing that one and then soma is like amnesia but underwater and we will be playing that one also so we definitely have more amnesia games that we'll be playing um which one fun dipper which one have you played okay so i only need the master key for that one So much to do, so much. Well, let's do this. Let's do this. Hey, Lonnie, have you played Bioshock? Sage, I am going to be playing Bioshock on uh, Twitch when I go over there. That's where I'll be playing that game. And again, just in case uh, you didn't hear, my Twitch will not be 18 and over. And I will be playing Bioshock over there. Different platform, different games, just different everything. Um, you know what? I don't know if I checked. Oh, wow. There's the wrench. I don't know if I checked the glove box to the car or not. I'll have to. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Okay. Oh, phew. So now I just need the master key. It's pretty good. Okay. Hello, Ains. Ains, how are you? I haven't seen you in a while. Uh, let's go. Okay, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go this way. I don't want to ring the bell again. I can get out with the car as long as I have, let's see here, what do I need to do? I think, hold on, I thought I needed something, but maybe not. Can I get out? Yes, we made it out. Oh my goodness. Um, I will tell you, hold on. Yes, 
Oh my gosh. Take that, Granny. That was my last day, too. Woo! That's how we start the stream. Ha! No, Samantha, I'm not done with um, with Freddy at all. In fact, I bought um, I bought Five Nights at Freddy uh, four, and but I'm stuck on the the security breach. There's a an area I can't get past. So. <sighs> Yay, thank you, OG, for my good game. Thank you, um, I'm Appeal, for my good game. And Samantha, thank you for my good games. <sighs> I have not seen the movie yet either. What kind of games will I be playing on Twitch? And also, too, I don't have the name yet, but Robert and I are going to be setting down and working on that uh, on Sunday. So I will have that in my in my link tree on Sunday. And I'm going to be playing, um, I'm going to be playing everything that I don't play here, I'm going to be playing over there. So like um, Bioshock, any, any, any game that I feel that's not super, um, super duper TikTok friendly, I'll be playing over there. That's how we're going to do that. Let's see here. Let me turn this down just a little bit because I feel like it's super loud. Okay. Now, you know what? I don't know about at last. I mean, and here's the thing. It's like I still have, um, I still have my own like comfort level that I need to deal with, and it's really gonna depend on the content. So I'll have to wait and see about that. So, yeah, but it's gonna be a completely different stream and it will be in the mornings. So it's, it not, it's not gonna take anything away from this stream at all. Okay, so this is called Endless Suburbia. And it's about me driving around a town, ah, 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 and scary things are supposed to happen. And if it's, I don't see how it could be scarier than the way I drive. Uh, I know, but I'm the only person in town, so I could drive on the sidewalks and nobody's gonna tell me I can't. So I don't run into any other cars. So I am, I'm the, I'm the queen of the road. I know. Okay. Um, hello, cheese. Why does it look comforting to live there, though? I don't know. The only thing that really bothers me is that some of the streets go straight into a house, and that really bought. I was just like, I just don't know why anybody would want to to have a house there. This is called Endless Suburbia. And I've heard that it's scary, but we're gonna give it a try. And I don't know why I'm driving looking out the side window. So I will, if you've seen this played before, if you have any, I think I just drive around until something happens. Ah! Have you played until dawn? No, I haven't. I looked and everybody tells me it's on um, Steam but it's not that's a that's a PS2 game correct hello Addy how are you this is called endless suburbia and something is supposed to happen so I'm trying ah I'm tr yeah it's PS4 that's what I thought they really do Jamie and I would fail every single time yeah you know what and that's just the thing Laura is I've really wanted to play it and I was like looking on Steam and I couldn't find it and I thought maybe I was just going cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs but I actually googled it and it said that no it's not it's not available on um, it's not available 
Okay, so when I was playing this earlier, I don't think I have headlights. I don't think I can turn my lights on. Um, so if you just joined, you can turn your phone sideways for a full horizontal view. So you can see how absolutely horrible I am at driving. But it's free? Oh, wow. This is called Endless Suburbia. And I, oh, I found my headlights. Victory, victory is ours. Okay, I was sitting here and I'm like, why am I driving around in the dark? And then I was like, I remembered what you all told me that F is always like the flashlight. So, oh, okay, Laura, I, I do have the quarry and I thought that that would be a fun game for us to play together. Now, here's the thing, everybody, and I want your opinion on this, but usually on Saturdays, I play like one game start to finish but I was thinking about making Saturdays into a day that we play quarry. And what do you think about that? Do, do. Uh, good evening, love. I was here about an hour ago and you weren't here yet. I was about two, I was just about five minutes late today because TikTok was doing an update. How's my day been? It's been good. It's been really good. Okay, see, I don't even stop for stop signs. Yeah, you know what, let's try it on Saturday and if we like it, maybe we can dedicate that day to like a quarry day. I've heard it's really super interactive. So I think that that would be a fun game for us all to play. You like that idea, Lizzie? Okay, like I said, it's a little bit more interactive. So it would be something that we could all definitely play together. I know, Kim. I'm just all over the road, though. I really do drive better than this. I hope you all know that. Valerie, this is called Endless Suburbia. Endless Suburb... Ah! Ah! Glacia, thank you so much for sharing my life. Oh, oh, oh. Hit a tree. Hexy, we are driving around... Um, looking for scary stuff and I've heard that it gets scary so we're gonna have to put this to the test yeah you know what Kim that tree got in my way the, the tree jumped in front of me yeah yeah and then after this we're gonna do some phasmophobia and then oh oh wow that's like an alien thing okay that's not good we should probably not try to get sucked up into the alien portal. Okay. Mr. Bean, thank you for harding me. And Elena, thank you for harding me. Brenda, I think. Elena, thank you for my roses also. Oh, look at There's somebody else getting sucked up into the portal. Uh-oh. Okay, so we have an alien attack. Oh, look it. There's the spaceships. Awesome. Okay, so we have aliens. Oh, and there's one there. Let's back up. Okay. Oh, there's one there. I think I shouldn't have stopped to take a look. I think we're. S it would, Danny. Trust me, I was pushing the button to run them over, and it wouldn't let me move. I think once I stop the car, and the aliens get me. Um. Let's restart that game. Are you sure? Uh, no, let's just keep going. Okay, so mental note to self. Don't stop car to look at alien attack. Got it. Okay, so we are not stopping the car for nothing. And if something, um, 
Oh, Tosh, you were playing False Dream today. How did you like it? I thought that was a really fun um, game. Okay. So we are not going to let up on... So the aliens now, it's grass so nice of them. <laughs> exactly. Now, I think it's going to be a different sort of threat this time. I don't think I don't think my car runs out of gas because it's a magical car and the steering wheel doesn't even have to move. So, it's magical. So, we're going to assume that I don't have to fill up at the gas station. Ah, Barb, thank you for um my gamer cat. I appreciate that. Ooh, really? We can hide in open garages. Let's start looking for those. I know. Uh-oh. Okay, so let's look for an open garage. I'm thinking... Let's see here. Let's see, let's see. Does anybody see a, a garage that maybe... Let's go this way. I mean, I am getting better with my driving, so I am... I'm giving myself a kudos for that. Oh. Oh, oh, gross. Okay, this one has spiders. This one has spiders, everybody. This one has spiders. I'm already crashing. This one has spiders. I don't like spiders. I, oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no. I'm on the sidewalk. There's spiders. Uh, we are not stopping. Uh, I'm panicking. Oh, Jiminy Crickets. Okay. Why does every single scary game have spiders? Okay. Let's go. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay, okay. Don't stop, Lonnie. Don't stop. Okay, I saw... Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Uh oh okay so this is a part of town that I have not seen oh I don't do roundabouts in real life I don't think I'm gonna do a roundabout in a video game I don't know whoever invented a roundabout but they are psychotic no 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 nope 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 oh my gosh we are spider food spider food nope Roundabouts are for other people, not for me. I think I know my I know my driving is scary, but I absolutely panicked seeing that spider. They give me so much anxiety because I don't trust other people that they're going to stop. Oh, no! No spiders. Oh, gross. It crawled over my car. All right, everybody. I'm trying to keep us, I'm trying to keep us alive. All right, keeping us alive. Keeping us alive, everybody. Okay. I'm just gonna go straight. Yeah, Elena, I did not like that. I did not like that. William, thank you for hurting me. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. I'm just going to go straight. No, there's an arachnid phobia. No, I, I see. I I have enough problems with spiders. I can't even talk with, uh, with spiders in video games. I don't think I could play a whole... I don't think I could play a whole video game about that. Oh, shoot. I have to turn. Okay. Let's see. Okay. All right. Let's key. I know, Shanita. I'm trying to keep my little baby bean safe. Hold on, everybody. There's big spiders out there. Roll up the windows and lock the doors. This is called endless, endless 
suburbia. Oh, what the hell? I didn't do that. What? What? Is that like a giant spider coming after me? What was that? What's, what's chasing me? Oh no, I feel that, I feel that I'm panicking under. Go, Lottie, go. Oh no, I ended up at the roundabout again. Go, Lonnie, go, go, Lonnie, go. Go, Lonnie, go. Who puts a roundabout in a spider, in a spider video? I don't like this music. All right, let's go. Oh, I just passed, passed an open garage. Oh, Shanita, you and me both, honey. I don't think I'm going to outrun this spider. Okay. What's behind me? Oh, Jesus Christ, they're in the fucking car. <laughs> Excuse my language, but they're in the fucking car. I cannot play this game. <laughs> Why did I look around? Uh. Okay, am I just like a spider taxi cab or something? <laughs> I'm a spider Uber. Why are they in my car? Why have they just not eaten me yet? Why are they in my car? You should try the Dark Pictures Anthology games. Ooh, I'll look into that. You're the one that told me about the fears to fathom and I absolutely love those. Why, why are they still here? Am I just driving spiders around? Okay. Okay, cool. Barb, it does not look like I do. How did they get in my car? Amber, how are you? Okay, let's try another one. Leafy, why are you, why did you say sorry? Yeah, worst nightmare ever, spider Uber. It's like, what do you want to do when you grow up, Lonnie? Oh, I just want to drive giant spiders around a deserted town. That's all I want to do. Yeah, you think for a moment in real life I would have kept driving? I would have just, I would have just gotten out of the car. I'd have drove. I would have stopped, dropped, and rolled. I'd have been like, "You take the car, everybody. I'm, I'm just gonna walk." Yep, that was a big. Oh no. Why did they wait so long to like put it to like to put an end to my misery? I knew they were in the back seat of my car. Yeah, I would have just smashed into a wall or something. <laughs> At least the spiders were responsible for what sitting in the back like a good passenger. What is that, Amber? Let's hear it. Yeah. Hello, Cole. How are you? Yeah, no, that was no, that was no fun. I, I mean, it was fun for the simple fact that it scared the shit out. I mean, you got to hear just about every single um, cuss word I had in my brain. Ooh, queso sounds good. Uh, the roommate situation has gotten more serious, and now my best friend is more. Oh wow! Congratulations. That's awesome. Well, you know what? Here's the thing, Amber. If you think it, it if you think it and feel it, it's probably true. Uh-oh. No, no. I don't want to look that way. Don't make me look that way. 
What do you think we're going to have to fight? We've already been taken by aliens. We've gotten eaten by spiders. Uh, oh, well, that's really cool. Well, I'm going to hope for the best, and I'm going to say it's more than a roommate. How's that? Oh, yeah. No, I, I doubt if I ever drive again. Ugh. Okay, I'm not too sure what we have in store for us now, but that's what I, oh, shoot. I was wondering the same thing. This one started out at night. Ah, well then I think that that's a very good reason, Amber, for not being here and I'm happy for you. I like butterflies in your tummy. I haven't played The Walking Dead, no. Oh, Danny, why, 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 why did you say that? That just made Danny no. Okay, tell your boyfriend that he has to de-spider car, his car before you ever get in there again. Okay, we're playing Endless Suburbia, and I just, I got taken by aliens. I was a spider Uber, and right now we're driving around uh-oh. Why does it do that? Uh-oh. We're driving around trying to figure out what is our next... What's the next problem? What's that up there? Thai soup sounds really good right now. I've been wanting some Tom Kai soup. Okay, I don't see anything yet. It has been a dramatic night. You should play it, but it's a long episodes and really fun. Which one was that again, Leticia? Because I don't mind a long video game. I mean, right now, Simple Minds is super long, but it's a really good game. Ooh, I love potatoes. I actually made myself a vegetarian uh, shepherd's pie today. I got a can of lentil soup and I drained it as much as I could and I put mashed potatoes on top of it and I had that with a couple of Hawaiian rolls and it was my version of a vegetarian shepherd's pie. Hello, silly. Um, oh, cool, thank you. Thank you, Laura. There's our roundabout again. And I like how they put a play area right in the middle of the roundabout. Like, people are, you know, like, put your kids right in the middle of a roundabout. What psycho would do that? <gasps> the Hawaiian rolls. I know. I've really been enjoying those lately. Just a Disney lover. Thank you for my rose. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Uh-oh. All right. We have a little bit of a situation going on now. Nicholas, thank you for the follow. Ah, Alyssa, thank you for my Ducks on Parade. Ducks on Parade. We have Ducks on Parade. We have a mama duck and a baby duck. And we have Ducks on Parade. Okay. Apparently, I have good tires because I just slid around that. So I think this one is driving in bad weather. Amber, thank you for hurting me and my game controller, honey. I appreciate that. Oh, I'm terrified of thunderstorms. So this game is basically every, every anxiety that I have, this game is all about it. Ducks on parade, ducks on parade. Well, honey, I'm always here, and I'm glad you're back tonight, just for as long as you can stay. Why, why, why? Oh! Uh-oh, what was that? Did I just get shot at? What was that? What was that? 
Did I get hit by lightning? This is like my anxiety, like everything that I'm scared of. Okay, not cool. I'm petrified of thunder and lightning and and spiders. So <laughs> Yes. Well, if somebody's going to, you know, be all up in my grill, I wanted to see my what my enemy looks like. I knew what the spiders looked like. They were scary. Um, let's look for open garages. start digging and zagging so then that way that lightning doesn't get me. I am, this is called endless suburbia and I'm driving around aimlessly trying not to get um, struck by lightning. I've already been a spider uber. I had big spiders in my car and I got uh, abducted by aliens. So I, I have not had the best night driving my car in this abandoned town. I'm trying. Savannah, thank you so much for sharing my live. I appreciate that. Do I appreciate you? Um, I sure can try. Let's, oh, let's try. I think I can go pretty much anywhere. Look, I can drive up on, oh, okay. Uh oh. All right, I was showing you I could drive up on the. Um, I was showing you I could drive up on the the um, the lawn, and I got, I got something. Um, thank you, Angel. We did make a mistake there. This is steam, yes. Tamara, thank you for the follow. Yep, there's only one way to learn. I don't know. I was driving in the um, I was driving on the grass and I got hit by something. Okay, so oh look. Let's go in here. Okay, so let's look around. Okay, well, I have a pretty nice car when it's not full of spiders. I don't know, Sydney. Um, it's definitely, it's definitely interesting. Oh, Elizabeth, that guy got banned. Th there was nothing. There was nothing. There was nothing nice about that one. So there's a huge difference between somebody calling me Nana or Granny or whatever. But when they have like that, you need to go to bed because you're too old kind of bullshit, that's an instant block. Angel got them immediately. But thank you. I was just, I was practicing. I was practicing, um, I was practicing my, um, my garage entry. So yeah, anytime like that, there's no niceties or there's no nothing nice. Yeah, Lizzie, I mean, but that's just the whole thing. It's just like it has nothing to do about, it has nothing to say about me and everything to say about them. So, you know, they come on here and they try to be, say something rude, thinking that they're going to ruin my day. And the only thing it does is tell me everything I need to know about them. It, it's, it, but the thing is, is I don't even, I mean, it's you might as well just say like hi my name is whatever and i am so unhappy and i hate my life and i just have no joy in it instead of trying to say something mean but here's the thing it's sometimes i mean these people do get to content creators and i see it all the time but for me y'all for everything that i've been through some jerk off who wants oh, excuse my language again but some jerk who wants to say something mean isn't going to get to me. They're just they're just not going to get to me. I don't have time for that exactly. 
And the fun, I mean, and it's not really funny, but the more ironic thing is, is like, if you want to hear something mean, you should hear the inner voices when you're battling. Um, you should hear my inner voices. Now, those are mean. Okay. Ah, oh, thank you, Alyssa. I appreciate my hand. My hand heart. I appreciate you. I, Caitlin, am having... I'm going to toast my Nutella Uncrustable, and I'm going to have it with a banana, and then I'm going to have some Laura Dune cookies. Yep, people are just hate. I feel sorry for them. Yep, exactly. Ah, Jade just sent a subscription to Amber. Amber, you just got a month's subscription uh, for free. Thank you, Jade. Yay. Oh, wow. What's going on here? Apparently we're having a weather anomaly. Yeah, Amber, now you're subscribed for a month and you get to use all the, uh, the cute little bean emotes. <laughs> I just drove into a sandstorm or a tornado. Oh, maybe I should find an open garage. Hello, is it, is it, Kada, is that how you say it? And I so apologize for not pronouncing your username correctly. Let's see if we can't find a... Yeah, if I get a tornado full of spiders, I'm done. This is called Endless Suburbia. And I am... Tis, thank you so much for sharing my live. I can call you K for short. Excellent. Thank you. Because I really do like to, um, I really do like to use the correct names. So I will call you K. Thank you. Spider name. Oh, what the hell was that? It looked like a chicken. A chicken just came crashing through my window. It was a person. Oh. I'm okay with that. I just didn't want to hurt a chicken. Okay, this is called Endless Suburbia, and I'm looking for an, ah, ah, an open garage to get out of this storm. Well, I'm pretty sure, you know what, they were, they were stuck up in the sandstorm anyway. I don't, I think they were already like, they were already, done for it. They were goners anyway. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get out of there. As long as a cow doesn't crumb crash in, I agree. Uh-oh. Alright, everybody. If anybody sees an open garage door, let me know. I think I'm, I think I'm driving pretty good considering that it's a tornado. This is called Endless Suburbia. I'm looking for a, some sort of like, I'm just afraid if I stop too much, I'm going to get attacked like I did by the aliens. Ah, thank you. Katarina, thank you so much for just, you just purchased an auto renewal. Thank you, Katarina. For pushing that over to auto subscription. I love you for doing that. Even though I'm scared of spiders and rainstorms and things like this. Thank you, honey. I appreciate that very much. All right, everybody. Oh, no, no, no. Go, Lonnie, go. There's a tornado. There's a tornado right there. Go around the tornado. Emma, thank you. Ah! No! Go that way. Drive. No, not into the poles. Uh, oh, there's dust all in my car. My car is a mess. Look at my nice car. It's all dirty. I appreciate you so much. Thank you. Okay. Sounds like a plane. 
Why is there a plane? Look at my car, it's completely filthy. It's a Dotson. I'm okay with that. Jade, thank you for, aw, oh, thank you for my hat. I love my hat. And Emma, thank you for hearting me. Jen, Justin, oh, shibbity crickets. Oh no. Toto, I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. <gasps> oh. Dang. Jen just sent out five subscriptions. So check your, um, check and see if you uh, just got one. So Leanne got one. Uh, Nick the Chick got one. Kaylee got one. Savannah got one. And Shelby got one. Congratulations to the new beans. Congratulations. We certainly are not. All right, everybody, let's do some phasmophobia. I think it's dark enough that we can do phasmophobia. Hi, Lonnie, hope you can play. Um, yeah, Brenda, I do have it. See, it's right there, Five Nights at Freddy 4. And maybe we'll play that one tomorrow. I've heard that's a good one. So let's do some phasmophobia. Shelby, thank you for my team bracelet. And Tippa Tyler B, thank you for my perfume. I appreciate that. Uh, I know, aren't those beans cute? I love, I love my beans. Uh, yes, my happiest memory. I still play Security Breach. I play it just about every day, but I'm stuck in an area that I cannot get past. So until I can get past there, um, I am not going to be playing here because it's just me doing the same thing over and over and over again. All right, everybody, hydration break. Important for water today. Welcome back. I've got some jobs ready for you. Yep, I'm still stuck on that. And I mean, I will get it eventually, so we will finish the game. I just, it gets really frustrating for me having you watch me do the same thing repetitively. And then I don't feel like I can give it enough attention. So I just feel like it's better for us to, um, for me to pass it when I'm not here online. Pam is currently sitting on my chest watching your live too. Aw, Pam. I love you, Pam. I love you, Pam. Okay, so what do you want to do? Do you want to do Willow Street again? I've heard the Brownstone High is 58 rooms. I mean, that's pretty intense. Um, so, I just muted somebody. Um, so that's pretty intense. I think that that would probably be more for, um, ah, Ruby, 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 Ruby just sent out some subscriptions. Do we now have 1,702 subscriptions? Um, I was going to say, why did you unmute them? Um, so let's see who got these. Ruby, thank you so much. Cassandra, you got a subscription. Uh, just a Disney lover. You got a subscription. Kyrie got it. Ames got it. And um, a little emoji got it. So whoever, um, I, I don't have your username, but congratulations. You have a subscription for one month. And then after that, you can uh, renew if you would like. Yay. Thank you. Yeah, I know. It's like, I like that angel. You're like, no, I'm going to unmute him. We were on that one right together. Oh, thank you, Car. I appreciate that. Yay, new beans. Lilith, thank you for my game controller. That's awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so I don't want to do the high school. I think that that's just too big for one person. So my question is, do you want to do the uh, Bleasdale Farmhouse or Willow Street? Because this one right here... This one has 16 rooms. No, 
Yeah, this one has 16. This one has 10. Um, can we do this one? Oh, do you want to do a random one? Or does that, no, I don't know if I want to do random. Willow, okay, let's do Willow Street. Um, uh, do all right. Um, yeah, that one was Willow Street. So let's go ahead and do that. So let's do Willow Street. And don't forget, I bought my extra equipment. So, yes, yes, Caitlin, I did not enjoy that um, farmhouse one just because it was so incredibly dark. Um, do, do. So before I do this, though, I am going to run go use the restroom because I have been definitely hydrating. So I will be right, right back. Grab some snacks, get something comfortable, and I will be right back. And I will be right back. Okay, I just ran into Robert, and he's going to join me on Phasmophobia, so I will have a teammate. Yay! I'll be right back. this. Amber, thank you so much. Thank you for, oh, my ducks on parade. Amber, they're ducks on parade. There's a mama duck and a baby duck and they're ducks on parade. Um. <laughs> yes, yes, I will let him know that. Thank you, Amber. I appreciate you. Alyssa, thank you for my ducks on parade. Nicole, thank you for my ducks on parade. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome back. I've got some jobs ready for you. Thank you, Danny. This is my um, this is my gray hair and tattoo sweatshirt. I actually have merchandise for my other for for that. Ducks on parade. Chelsea, thank you for the follow. I love my ducks on parade. Yay. Amber, thank you for my good games, honey. Thank you. Okay. All right. Well, if you ever wanted to check out my merchandise for gray hair and tattoos, it is in my link tree. Elizabeth, yay. Elizabeth just sent out five subs. So we have a sub wave we have a sub wave sub wave um okay uh yay sub wave 
All right, Alyssa, thank you for my rose. Let's see here. Okay, so on the last one, Barbara got one. Chelsea Green got one. Um, let's see here. Uh, Fonty got one. Ariana got one. And Le uh, Lily got one. Awesome. Do you, oh, you found uh, you found Grays? I I think that's amazing. Jen, thank you for my corgi. And OG, thank you for my corn. Okay, resume. Let's go uh, multiplayer. Looks like there are others out and there we're going to help. join private. And then it's seven, six, three. Hold on. Okay, two, four, okay. I love my corgis on parade. Oh, oh, there we are. Oh, and Robert, yeah. there's, uh, they want our characters to stand next to each other for a minute. Um, so they can send me a cowboy hat and a mustache because it makes me look like you. Oh, never mind. Wait, come here really quick. Oh, he laughed. Tiffany, thank you for my high bear, my pink shoes, and my game controller. Yay! Are you there, Robert? Are you there, Robert? Uh, yeah. Okay, you can hear me? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, cool, thank you. I like it. <laughs> I like that I haven't dyed my hair. How long has it been happening? I see. I think gray hair is gorgeous. Okay. Did you want to pick a, a spot, Robert? Yeah. 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 Uh, you want to pick the? Do you want to pick the place, and then I will bring this up? Uh, I'm sure. Yeah, because uh, the we were gonna play Willow Street. It has ten rooms and two floors. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to click on that right now. You need to click on it too. Where are you walking? Where are you walking to? I can hear you walking. I'm not walking anywhere. I'm over at this thing. Grabbing some stuff. Okay. Do you want me to ready up? Yeah, I just put Robert's uh, Twitch name down there. Okay, I'm ready. ready. Yes, I'm ready. Huh? I think I did it wrong. You did Willow Street? Yes. Okay, okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, uh, mine says readies, but yours says unready. Oopsie. Okay. Okay. Now we both say ready. Yep. Okay, we're going. All right. Hey, Robert, hold on a minute. I'm going to turn up the micro or the gameplay so they can hear you a little bit better. Okay, okay. Now I can turn my microphone up. Really. Okay. Uh, yeah, I can t hear you much better now. Oh, you can, okay. All right. You ready, Spaghetti? All right, I'm ready to go get some ghosts. <laughs> okay. I, I, will, uh, I will be your apprentice, and I will take your lead. Dude, you're a guy. And it looks like you're holding an ice cream cone with no ice cream cone. 
reckless with these are just my hands i don't i don't know what to tell you <laughs> you need to shave too okay all right this isn't a roast all right all right what do you what do you what are you grabbing for? okay i was thinking d about doing the emf reader and the thermometer and then my flashlight okay dokie what are you getting? I'm bringing a flashlight and a camera so I can document your ghost journey. But you can grab something else too. Yeah, but I don't, I don't need something else. You got all the good stuff. Oh, well, I'll, I'll put something back. <laughs> okay, I'll grab the EMF reader too. Okay. <laughs> oh, don't you want to know the ghost that we're getting? Uh, yeah, please. Uh, can you tell me a little about it? This is Lisa Sherman. She responds to people who are alone. We need to capture a photo of the ghost. We need to have evidence on the EMF reader. And then we need to detect paranormal sound with a parabolic microphone. So that we don't have. Oh, we do have, actually. I was going to say, I had one. Yeah, you have one. Yeah, because this is, is this all the stuff you have? Or is this my stuff? This is stuff that, it's a little bit of both. We, we, you can both bring in things. Oh, uh, so okay. Some stuff, you run in some stuff. Okay, cool. Okay, I'm ready. I'm so excited. But I'm, okay, so part of my mother instincts is kicking in, and I think I need to just follow you around and protect you because they're going to get me first. No, no, I'll, I'll follow you. I'll follow you. All right, try to keep up. I'm a pretty good ghost hunter. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right, we're going in. All right, everybody. Hey, Robert, how many hours do you have on this game? On this game? Yeah, yeah. I mean, are you, are you like a super high level? Uh, no, no, I've, I only have 54 hours on this game. Oh, okay. And if anybody wants Robert's um, uh, information, he's here on TikTok as Sherbert also, and with the underscore, and he has a link tree. So if you want to find him on TikTok, he'll, he will take you right over there also. All right. Iris, thank you for cheering me. All right. All right. So last time. Where'd you go? Oh. Um, all right, all right, let's do this. Okay, cheese. So this isn't, oh, you know what? Did he go in here? Did he go in here? Yes, he must have gone in here. Hey, Robert, do you want me to go upstairs? Sure. Do you know I where don't this? I think this actually, I think, I no, there's, it's downstairs, so there's a basement. So it's downstairs. I was just going to say, I just didn't know, I didn't, I didn't know where upstairs was. <laughs> the way back to you were upstairs already. Now you're downstairs. Okay. Oh. This is a house that has like a gazillion different little rooms. Yeah, it's kind of tricky. There's a lot of places to hide, which is good, but they're kind of scary. Especially when the ghost is down. Jen, that would have been so much fun. You know what? You can tell him if he ever wants to do this. Um, he could um, absolutely join us at night. That would be so much fun. Hey, Robert, did you ever used to game with Brandon on this game? No, not not this game in particular. No, Brandon Brandon plays it a lot though. Yeah, that's what Jen was saying. We're used to. I'm surprised that neither one of us has found anything with our EMF reader. 
copy that. Copy that. But don't you? Oh, but don't you find it? Don't you find it? Don't you find it strange that we haven't found anything with the EMF reader? Because we're supposed to get evidence of that. Oh, really? Oh, where's the bone? Where's the bone? Where's the bone? Where's the... But that doesn't make sense because you don't know what room to set up and prep in. Got it. Like we like we still have another uh -oh. minute and six seconds. I forgot my thermometer. Oh, okay. What did you grab what did you grab? And then, ooh, I'll get this too. It's, oh. it's easier because, like, you don't have to take as many trips because we have, like, five minutes. Um, okay, I got the thermometer and a notebook. Emily, how are you? Okay, so. How do you know it's in the kitchen, though, Robert? It's, I don't. It's just it's like the most common area to the grab things. It's the, it's just the middle ground. So like, let's, let's just let's just say like hypothetically, like it's in the basement. Instead of going from the basement all to the trailer, we're going from the kitchen to the basement to the kitchen to the basement. Oh, got it. See, and we're just kind of we're just kind of like eliminating that. That once we do figure out what room it is, we don't have to take so many trips. Okay, well, I'm still going to walk around with my EMF thingy yeah, while you're... I think that's a really good idea. Um, this, I'll be the trailer jockey, and you just uh, you be our ghost mode. Okay. All right, let's do this. Let's do this, everybody. I am the bait. I usually am. You know, I, I, and I, I accept that role um, graciously. So now, do you think ghosts are less likely to come out if there's two people? It really is depending. So if you go to the journal and you go to overview, it'll tell you whether or not the ghost um, is more responsive to, as I said, this one right here says, uh, least responsive when people are alone. So it says it's least it we should stick together then? No, it responds when people are all up. Oh, so got it. Better if we split up. Roger that. See, that's like professional ghost talk. I said roger that. Oh, did you see that right there? We had a little bit of drop of temperature right here. A little bit, a little bit. Thank you, everybody. All right. So sometimes when I'm I'm playing um, with with Robert, I, I forget. One more trip and we should be good. Roger that. Um, if you all have, <laughs> if you have any suggestions, let me know. Even though Robert's playing, we're still in this together. So do you think when you find that bunny rabbit, do you think that that's like an indicator that the ghost is in here? No. It's, it's just RNG. Okay. Because if there was a, if there was like an indicator of like a bunny to like 
what room the ghost is, it'd be a really lame ghost cave. Because then you would just be more of find the bunny versus like figure out the ghost. Okay, so I'm not going to tell you I thought that that would be really cool. Let's try down here. All right. I have the thermometer, but I don't see temperatures dropping anywhere. Dude, you just told me I had a cheap thermometer. All right, I did not come into this game insulting your shit, so leave mine alone. I didn't. Well, I'm not insulting anything. I'm just saying that it's a nice thermometer. Nobody's, nobody's, you know, knocking you there. It's just, I, it's not my first tool I would use to find a ghost. All right, so let's see here. I'm going to try to find her with the little um, ghost thingy, the little box thing that I talked to him. Yeah. Lisa, can you hear me? Lisa, are you in the garage? Over and out, Lisa. Are you here? Where were you at, Robert? I'm down in the basement in this room. As soon as you go down in the basement, the first room. Um, Did you get that with the EMF reader? Yeah, the EMF reader just spiked it. It's not, a, it was a four. So it's in this room. Okay. All right. So now oh. I'm going to go grab a camera real quick. Okay, yeah, so leave me also down. Okay, I was going to say, leave me down here, and I'm going to try to talk. I'm gonna try to talk to her. Was it throwing? Oh, it's throwing stuff. Oh, really? What did it throw? I just threw all these tools. Oh, knocked so down all these, all these things. Lisa's pissed. So we might, uh, we might see fingerprints if you want to go grab the black light too. Well, I was gonna sit down there and talk to her, but I'll go grab the black light. I mean, I mean, <laughs> I mean, let's go to talk to her. Talk to her. Let's tell you to live your life. <laughs> Pick a Luhu, that's my oldest son, Robert. You know what? It always seems like the 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 girl all of my ghosts are pissed off. I have yet to find a happy ghost. Do you want to turn off your flashlight? I got the black light. So it doesn't look like any fingerprints are on there. Okay. Yeah, I don't see anything on the black light. Nope. How are we on temperature? On what, Robert? On your temperature? Are we freezing yet or no? I forgot my thermometer upstairs. Yeah, you told you insulted my thermometer, so I left it upstairs. Lisa, are you down here throwing things around over? Lisa, can you hear me? Lisa, are you there? I hear the yeah, EMF thing EMF. going. Four on the EMF, yeah, nothing. Not a five. It is becoming more active. Did you want to step out really quick and I'll try to talk to her? Yeah, 
Lisa, are you down here throwing things around over? Lisa, use your words over. Lisa, why are you in here? Lisa, can you hear me? Nothing, Robert. Nothing. Now, do you want to go back and look at our, for orbs and stuff? Yeah, we can totally do that. Okay. Okay, so also before I do though, the hunting when it hunts, it's kind of tricky down here. I mean, you could go in this room right here and hide. And there's also hiding. Oh shit! She she just fucking walked right by me, Robert. I know. <laughs> I hear I hear it in your voice. You're like. I got I got, I got, I got the hair in my. my <laughs> up. Okay, so I. Let's go check. Yeah. Check orbs. Yeah. Can you walk faster? We are the slowest walking ghost hunters. I know. Well, I you just want to get out or like, okay, let's boogie. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Robert got stuck in there and it's hunting. No. I long I, I I left my baby in there. <laughs> I left my baby in there. Oh no. This is like a mom's worst nightmare. <laughs> well shit, that bitch is gonna get it now. Robert, are you still here? Over? Oh, bring it on. Lisa got pissed. I don't know. It's the front door still locked, and I don't know if Robert's still alive. Jamie, we're playing Phasmophobia, and I'm playing it with my oldest son. Oh, that is not okay. <sighs> not good over exactly. Ah. Uh... Oh, if he wasn't, it would have ended. Okay. Thank you, Caitlin. That makes me feel good. That makes me feel like I can hide without feeling guilty. I like how I was outside and I came back in to try to rescue him. <laughs> no, I won't talk to him. I won't. Oh, I hear something. Hello, Kinsey. How are you doing, hon? Mm -hmm. <sighs> 
Do you think it's clear? Okay. Robert, are you okay? Oh, man. I don't want to. It has a question mark. Oh no, we got Robert. It does have a question mark. I'm pissed now. All right, well, we need to do this for Robert. Let's go back in there and see if we can't. Um... <sighs> He was right behind me. He was right behind me. Oh, look at, there's his flashlight. Oh my gosh. You, oh, that, okay. You have no idea how fucking pissed I am right now. Excuse my language. That bitch just got my baby. Okay, the crucifix is all burnt up. I don't see. I don't know. And the worst part is, is now I have to step over him every time I go out. Okay, so that's... Okay, I don't have an EMF. It's not really registering. Okay, so that's... I don't want to take a... Okay, we have freezing temperatures. So we definitely have freezing temperatures. So let's go freezing temperatures. So... Okay, we have that. Oh, Tiffany, he knows better than that. So we got that. I don't see finger. Do you all see? I don't see any. I don't see any UV. So let's go ahead and drop that. Nope. That was a five, yeah. Ball, I know, he didn't text me, he didn't do anything. You think it was a no bar? It was a hand too. That I've was never had. Hard goes. I was gonna say, Robert, I've never had that one before. I do have ghost hunting insurance, so I made one hundred and seventy. Oh man. I have ghost hunting insurance, so I made one hundred and seventy-seven dollars. Okay, nice. Have Have you ever had that one before? Oh yeah, I'm, sh I'm sure. This This whole game got like a new update, like really recently so I couldn't tell you whether or not I got on that one well I will tell Fire you what I will tell you what I the words that came out of my mouth when I figured out you were locked in that house I was so pissed you were right behind so me funny. yeah well I thought okay so I thought you locked the door like or I thought you shut the door and then I thought you were trying to open the door to like get me like out I said, Monty, Monty, I think you locked me. I think you locked me in. And all of a sudden started hunting, and I had nowhere to run, and then it got me. Oh. Like it, it was just a fraction of a second late. Let's play that okay, one now. again, and I'll show you a really good hiding spot in the front room. Okay, bet. Okay, bet. Soon. I'm good at hiding. <laughs> <sighs> and then 
also do if I'm still low, you can turn up my microphone as well. Like no, I, actually, I can hear you fine. I can feel you. I can hear oh, you okay, good. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm playing with Robert again. Now you all can hear him, right? Because I can hear him fine, but I just want to make sure you can hear him. Ready up. Okay, good. You have to click next to me, ready. Okay, I read it up. Okay, the next time we go running out of a house, you have to run in front of me. All right. Responds to everyone. We are looking for our Carlos Myers. He sounds pretty mean. Yeah, he, does, he sounds like a mean old Okay, so on the last one, it burnt up the cross. I mean, wouldn't that have stopped it from hunting? It, yeah, it does, yeah. When the crucifix breaks, breaks up or, like, burns up, that means it stops the hunting phase. It was just hunting very often. Like, it stopped that oh, one got phase, it. but it just went, it went and started right again. All right, well, I got my stuff. All right, you ready to party? Yes, I am. Let's do this. Ghost hunting part two. I think we would have lived if we actually knew how to like just slow jog out. We were the two of the Nothing slowest like running. <laughs> that was so bad. Okay, everybody wants us to stay together. <laughs> yeah. Well, we paused by everyone now, so we should be chill. Okay, Robert, right over here. See that behind the crates right there? Oh, yeah, look at that. That's a really good hiding spot. I like that idea. You're welcome. All right, let's go look, let's go look, let's go look. Even though I know this is a game, my motherly instincts were off the chart. I wanted to break that window and get back in there. I'd be like, no, take me, not my baby. Yeah. I often worry about the kitty cat because you can clearly see they own a cat, but I've never found the cat. You know, I mean, it could be like an outside cat. With inside toys? It, it could be an inside outside cat. That makes more sense. Uh -huh. All right, let's see what we got here. Let's see what was the stuff on the in the the bones in the kitchen again over? Uh, no, it was in one of the bedrooms over. Got it. Over. <laughs> I'm trying to be brave. Okay. All right. Well, thank you, Tara. Okay. There's that mysterious bunny again. What room did you see the bone? Was it the one with the bunny? Over? It was not, no. I think it was the one opposite of the bunny room. I don't, I, honestly, I don't think that bunny changes. I think it's a very stagnant piece of, like, like part of the map. I don't know. That bunny doesn't look like it has anything good. It has no good intentions.
All right, I'm going to go back in over. Let's go and let's go in there and see if we can't see any temperatures dropping. It is a mischievous looking bunny and I see it in every single house. Okay, I don't see anything moving. Okay, nothing. I don't see. Oh, do you think that that's anything? Why is there a teddy bear? Hey, Robert, is there a haunted teddy bear? I don't think so, no. I think it's okay. just belongs to a child and children are treated creepy. Oh, I'm trying to, I'm trying to see if the temperature drops. Because if the temperature drops, that will tell me where the ghost is. And right now, I have not seen any dropping temperatures. I saw the voodoo doll. Um, on that one, I took it out of the house, and it really pissed the ghost off. Okay, I still have been sweeping around with the thermometer. And I haven't seen anything over. Over. Awesome. I'm right here. I'll check for the temperature over. See, I said over. I'm going uh, to start setting up camcorders for ghost orbs. Got it. Good. I'm glad you all are having fun. I have so much fun playing with him. Hey, Ro Robert, where were you? Where were you when you got the EMF? I was, I was right here. Okay. Okay. Oh, shit. Don't have... Okay. Hey, how did you put the flashlight on your shoulder? Oh. I mean, I'm just shoot. <laughs> I'm just running in circles. <laughs> Get out of the house. Where are you, over? Let's just use the garage as. Well, do you do you want me to go get another camera and another dots, and I can set it up right here? No, I think we're. Honestly, I think what we can do is we can work in the garage and then kind of play out. Uh, but I, I think we go play for or go check the ghost room. Okay, can you please go out out on the porch? I'm just yeah, following. Uh oh. Run, Robert. It's hunting, run. Nope, got me. I sacrificed myself so Robert would not get caught. That's I'm that's the that's how I'm spending that. That is how I am going to spin that. I so moved from my hiding spot to see if Robert could do it. He's on his own. Uh oh. <gasps> Oh no, it's still hunting. Run, Robert! Dude, run! 
That was the ghost. Oh no, Robert. Oh good, Robert's got the crucifix. He's gonna get that ghost now. Sorry, Robert. Okay, can I fight the ghost now that I'm a ghost? Can I just like throw blows on the ghost to save Robert? Yeah, I think I should be able to ghost. I think I should be able to fight the ghost. It's definitely in the kitchen. I saw it right here. So it was definitely right here. Okay, I'm using my mother's psychic powers to tell Robert. See, look at he's moving all the stuff right here. Can I pick up his stuff? I can't pick his, his stuff. Can I go out to the garage? Oh, I can leave the house. I run faster as a ghost than I do in real life. Oh, good for Robert. He's checking the orbs. I like that. I don't think it's the kitchen either, but it appeared in the kitchen. Does he know I'm, does he know that I'm not alive? But it was weird because the Eve right signal was in the, the gay realm. I don't see any orbies. Well, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> Use the spirit box, Robert. I don't want to freak him out. I'm afraid he's going to bolt if I do that. Kendall, thank you so much for hearting me. Mason, thank you for hearting me. And Joan, thank you for my rose. I appreciate that. Oh, dude, run. <gasps> it's hunting again. It's fight. Oh, look it. There he is. Oh, it went down to the basement. Robert, no. Go, go, go. I'll protect you. I'm protecting you. Dude, 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 this is heartbreaking. I don't think it's a flag. I think you're a spirit box. Okay, good, good, good. I got your back, Jack. I got your five. Is that how they say it? Uh, hello, ghost. You killed my mom. <laughs> Can you give me a sign? Are you here? Are you listening? You're not listening. Hello? Hear me? Oh. Dude, dude, dude! Oh, that was good. Yeah, run, Robert, run! I got your back. Oh, you fucker, leave him alone. Leave him alone. Leave him alone. Ah! Ah! I was. I was trying so hard to defend you, Robert. I was trying to beat up the ghost. Whoa, really? Yeah, it's horrifying. I could see the ghost. I was following you around and I was listening to you, but I could see the ghost and it, it was in the kitchen and then it ran really? down into the, yeah. And then it was throwing shit around in the kitchen and then it ran down yeah. into the basement and I wanted to it fight the ghost. Yeah, that's I, really? I I tried to fight it. Zoraiji. Well, what I don't know. Oh, man, that was that was crazy. You ready to do it again? I'm ready. All right, I still think we should do this house. Yeah, I, I think we go until we win. Okay. Uh, excuse me, you're standing right in my way. Hello. You can you can you, you press if you press spacebar, it pushes you right to the board. So it's not so much of a. Oh, I'm actually in the way. 
Yeah, you were like, you were right in my way. Oh, hold on. All right, I'm ready. It says you're not, though. Oh, okay. All right, ghost hunting, take three. We have Thomas Emmett. He responds to people who are alone. Detect a paranormal sound with the um, parabolic microphone. Prevent a ghost hunting with the crucifix. And have a member of your team witness a ghost event. I think we can absolutely witness a ghost event. Knowing our luck, our little string of, uh, a string of uh, ghost encounters. I got my EMF reader. I have my um, photo camera, and then I have my flashlight. All right, I accidentally picked up the little like glow stick, but I'm okay with that. Sure, I mean, yeah, even you can drop it, but I mean, hey. Can't, you know what, truthfully, I, I, I really have a like lot of fun playing with Robert just because you know, it's an opportunity I don't get we're, to do very often. We're the mother, I think son, it's, uh, ghost team extraordinaires. Yeah, mom and Bert busters. Yeah. All right, ghost, whose name I forgot already. Thomas. Thomas, thank you. Um, I think it's, I really like playing this on my own because I think it's scarier, but it's I definitely. Found you found a bone already? Yeah, yeah, I was in the bathroom. But playing with Robert is a lot of fun. Baba, thank you so much for my heart. So do you think it's weird that, hey, Robert, do you think it's weird that you got the EMF reading in the garage, but the ghost was really in the kitchen? Oh. Got it. Over. Going down into the basement. Over. Roger. I forget to say over like 90% of the time. Well, I think it was definitely more stressful watching Robert ghost hunt on his own. Okay, perfect. I'm be I got my brave pants on today. Over. Yeah, that was a tough ghost, man. It was aggressive. Tara, um, it's a push to talk. So I hear him when you hear him. So basically, if everything you hear, I can hear. We just had a ghost event at an EMF five. Whoa, where at? Right here in the kitchen. In the kitchen. So it's either gonna be here in the bathroom. It's like right where I'm standing. So I'm not really sure which where it's gonna be. Okay, it could be. I mean, it, it looks pretty kitchen-like. I think it's in here oh, because yeah, there's. Yeah, it's got, we got dirty water. We got dirt. Do I don't have my camera. Okay. Over. Hello, ghosty ghost. Can you hear me? Hear me. Get ready to run, though, Robert. I said, just get ready to run, because I don't think I can handle another like having to watch you do this on your own. Oh yeah, it's not. It wasn't super fun. 
first time. I got the picture. Thank you. Hello. Do we have? Yes. Do you want me to go get the camera? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the, the, the video camcorder. Yeah, I'll go get the video camcorder and the. I got the, one set up here. Oh, you do have them? Yeah. Oh, then we don't need two. It's a small little spot. I can go get that. Yeah, okay, I'll just stay here by myself. Well, then you go get it. No, no, it's fine. No, I already came I'm back. Fine. You go get it. I'm fine, baby. No, it's fine. Everything's okay. <laughs> go get it. Go get it. I, I'll be here. Okay. So let's see what we got going on here. I'm still alive in here. Okay, I don't see anything. Okay, I don't see anything. I'm still alive, over. I'll put the second book right here just because I keep saying it's just a short area. Okay. Uh oh, the door's shutting. <laughs> Where are you going? Let's put the dots thing I'm and go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Put the dots down and let's get the hell out of here. Like a leaf. Run. <laughs> I can't run. Apparently, my both feet can't leave the ground. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Whew. Let me see how fast you can run. <laughs> you place those dot things really well. Yeah, I thought I thought you did. I wish you could turn them on and off. Like, actually, let me go put a second. Oh, oh wow, you're really good at this. Well, yeah, you have to turn it into like the other one sees orbs. This one sees the dots. Oh. Someone said the door moved. All right, well, let's just look here for a minute and see if anything moves. And then we can, we can switch the camera again and look for, yeah, like um, for orbs. I like it. I've been learning. Yeah, I was going to say. Yeah, we just look for... Can, can you not flash the flashlight right on the screen? Okay, well, you know. <laughs> okay, so now let's look for orbs. I'm going to go in the house. Why are you going in the house? I can't hear you over. You have to use your walkie over. Why are you going in the house over? Lay salt down. Over. Needs a space oh. Well, hold on. I'll come, I'll come have your back. What's this guy's name? Oh, gosh. The dog, Indy just scared me. Indy just scared me. Indy just absolutely scared me over. Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, we got ghost writing. Oh, we have ghost writing? So we have ghost writing in EMF5, eh? Counts because it was during a ghost event. Oh. We for sure have ghost writing. Indy's all upset about something. Over. 
I'm more upset about the dog. Are you gonna are you gonna already? are you gonna talk to the ghost? I mean I'm trying to. You're not saying anything. I don't have I don't have okay. Oh I have it. Where's it at? It's on somewhere. There you go. Hello, ghost. Can you move something for me? Can you turn the lights on? Can you shut this door? Can you... Oh, we got footprints right here. Can you take oh, wow. the camera? No. Oh, we got the camera. No, there's one right here. Hey, yeah, can you take the salt in the footprints? Can you close this door? Can you turn on the lights? What does um, the salt in the footprints mean? Say something. Say something. Turn off your light. We need enough spikes at four. Still four. Ghosts, even though, like, it says they're responsible when people are alone. Has it thrown anything? Yeah, that's what throws and stuff. So m we might see footprints. If there's a black light. Oh, it's riding on something right here. Look at it. Yikes. So that was riding on both books? Mm hmm. You know, four. Where's your thermometer? Oh, wait. Got it. I got the thermometer. Temperature's going up once I left the bathroom, so I definitely think. Yeah, so I think it is in the bathroom. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Run! Of what? Of what? Of the goat. If you take a photo of the ghost or the ghost event, you get money. Okay, I no longer have the camera. <laughs> so, okay, so it absolutely is in this room. Let me turn the camera the other way. Because it appeared on the toilet. So I think he did it. I think he died on the pooper. Oh, Elvis is in the building. Elvis, let's go check once again. Please run. I can't run. I can only, like, I can only shaw shaw. Well, well, walk quickly. Let me just sway my hips outside. <laughs> there you go. Well, I think that's... What happened to it? I uh, I put the camera the other way. <laughs> well, I'm gonna I'll go back in with you because there's no way I'm watching you. I I have to go by myself so he does like ghost activity thing. Oh, you don't you don't want me to be here? No, I just think I think the ghost is gonna respect me more if I don't bring my mommy. <laughs> Well, too bad. You said a shot about that before we started ghost hunting together. Did he throw it? <laughs> I thought you were going back to the chair. <laughs> no, I wanted to make sure you get out okay. I am not going to oh, lose okay. you again. Melissa, thank you for hearting me and my rose again. Oh, I see a ghost orb. Yeah, you see it right there? There's ghost orbs. Yes, I see the orbs. Okay. All right, so we got orbs, we got riding. 
So it's either a mayor, a rev, a revent, revent, a revenant, revenant, revenant or a fay. Or fay, yeah. So for a mayor, we need a spirit box. For a fay, we need dots, and for a revenant, we need uh, freezing terms. Okay. Well, then why don't we look for the dots? Others? Yeah, that's a great idea. It, I mean, it's got footsteps and stuff, so like I reckon. I think maybe if you just have a little bit of a, um, a little bit more patience, we might be able to see something. So like the characteristics of a fae are, upon entering the location, fae's will become more active and defensive and agile. Their weaknesses are, fae's will weaken over time, making them weaker, slower, and less aggressive. Revenants are, will travel at significant faster speed when hunting their prey, and then the weaknesses hiding from red revenant will cause it to move very slowly. And then a... Not bad. Mare is a mare will have uh, increased the chance to attack in the dark. Turning the lights on around a well, mare will weaken its chance to attack, but we don't really have any of those. Um, I mean, the revenant makes the m oh no, the revenant the, the thigh thigh makes the most sense because it was like really hostile. Okay, you think it was hostile? It was. I mean, he was definitely more active and he was like throwing things and things. Do you want to stay stay on the dots? I'm gonna go check the temperature. You because I can go in with that. Where's the microphone? Uh oh, we lost the microphone. <laughs> it's in. It's in my hand. Over. <laughs> Oops. Okay, I don't see. What? What? I, I was coming to save you. <laughs> the thing is, okay, so like, you yeah. have to stay on the dots because if it's the dots and nobody's here to see it and I die, it's like a, it's like a, we, we get nothing benefits from my death, you know? All right. All right. All right. All right. Then I can go back in if you want okay. to be on the dots, and I can go to try to talk to this person. Well, we have to. Okay, okay, okay. Well, we have to. Um, if you're going to do that, can you put that dots on the other way so we can crisscross? Because we can check out both angles. You see what I mean? Yes. I'm not super excited about going in, but I'd rather go in than have you go in. Well, I'm going to put the dots thingy down, and then I'll be right back. Trying to get out over. Okay, okay. Whew, that was scary. Just 
doesn't want to just want to give us that last final thing. The only other oh, it just. But do we just see dots or is that? No, it just some it just moves something. Oh, it moves something. Well, if that's well, if it moves something, do you think we should have seen it? See, I thought if it moved something that we could use that for dots, but then I don't think that's it. No, no, you'd see you would see like a like a silhouette, I think. Because what what were the other two? The spirit box. Um, spirit box or freezing temps. Well, I'll go back I in. I don't think it. Yeah. I'll go back in. I'll check I mean, the I temperature. Don't, I don't think it's freezing temps. Yeah, I don't think it's freezing temps. Then let me go try to talk to Thomas, and I'll see what happens. Okay, I can do it. I can do it. You can do it. No, I cannot handle the pressure of watching you go back in, and I made it out first. Yeah, you yeah, haven't. You watched it. Oh my God, we got dots. We got dots. We got dots. <laughs> I just turned around so fast. It was funny. So you did get dots, Robert? Uh, yeah, one hundred percent. So it's a fake. If you if you look close enough, you might see it again. It was actually really close, but it's one hundred percent, one hundred percent dots. Okay. Well, if you saw dot, I'll let you. You're the ghost. You're the ghost hunting pro. I mean, I don't know. I just stared at the TV screen. Uh, but we did it! Hooray! All right, so you put in all your evidence. You put it in um, dots. Hold on, I'm doing that right now. Your, uh, okay, okay. So we got. Okay, I have it circled. Okie dokie. Yeah, because we had dots, we had ghost orb, we had. Um, ghost all right, ready to lock it in? That's a 10 4 there, big buddy. Good job. That yeah, was awesome. Yeah, we need a Robert Bean with like a big old mustache. Welcome back. I prepared some jobs for you. We did pretty good. Oh, wow. Dang. All right. Look at all that money. Yeah, oh, wow. I just leveled up. I can do intermediate. I got a tripod and cool. I just got 500 silver coins. <laughs> I don't know what the coins are for. I don't know what the coins are either. Well, what level are you? Um, I feel so accomplished. Yeah, you did good. Did you want to do another one? Yeah, we could do one more. Are you okay with that? Yeah, can I just take a quick bathroom break? You sure, you sure can. And you can talk to them. They're listening. They can hear you. Oh, okay, great. Yeah, be nice. All right, I'll be right back. I'm going to go use the bathroom. I didn't mute myself. I was trying to figure out how to put on a one of them dang parabolic microphones. And caught it red-handed.
What happened, Robert? The nub in your town. Ah. Uh, now, did you lose your stuff because you left it in the house? No, no. You only lose your stuff, like, I think when you die. And then, and then, okay. then you just get, like, you get insurance. You get part of it back. So you have to, like, rebuy slash re-add stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're okay. We're, we're all good. We've got everything. All right, what house do you want to do? Do you want to do Ridgeview Court or because I heard the high school, the high school's got like a thousand, it's 58 rooms. The high school is like absolutely ginormous. Yeah. Um, wanna, I mean, like, how hard do you want to get? How hard do you want to do random? Do you want to do like really, really hard? Well, I, I don't know. I, the only th Willow Street is the last one. I mean, that's all I've unlocked. Oh, OK. But it's up to you. About oh, there's a prison? Uh, do you want to just do random? Yeah, we can do random. Okay. Ready when you are. Oh, the random one. We got Willow Street again. The oh, same house again. All right, we're here. <laughs> it's Anthony Norris. <laughs> okay, Indy was um, participating. Okay. Are you ready, Spaghetti? Yes, I got my um, I got my old crappy thermometer. Okay, you mean your super awesome scientific, uh, like, game-breaking thermometer? Yep, the one that I used in 1972. Okay. Oh, okay, good. Oh, I don't have a flashlight. I'm gonna go get one of those. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start ghost hunting over. All right, let's do this. Flashlight in hand, on my way. Still ghost hunting. Over. So now that I'm no longer um, a rookie, do you, oh. Why'd you take a picture of over? Uh, I found the bones. You always find the bones. Yeah. I'm going to start bringing your stuff to the kitchen table. Roger that. All right, let's see what we can find, everybody. Let's see what we can find. I know, he's like super, super bone picker. Some creepy. Oh, we just had a plate move in the kitchen. Oh. On my way. Lots of things are we have EMF, but it's not over three. That was fast. Yeah, people are alone, my hands. Uh, all right, I'm gonna get more speed. So we have ghost writing. Ghost writing, got it. Okay. <laughs> Andy's always thirsty. She wants to remind us that we need to hydrate. She's very good on that. Um, I'm in the house by myself. Do you want to make it cold? No, we, we picked random and they put us right back at the same house. Is 
Is it dropping? No. I've been checking the thermometer and it, it's not very cold. Yeah, it takes a while for it to like to actually see freezing temps. Because it's so old. So you can like throw it down and pick it up and throw it down. It, it's nothing that'll like happen like drastically. Let's see if we see any any evidence. Oh, okay. No, it's just we, we put it on random. I mean, I don't know why it brought us back to this one. So it was just kind of like the luck of the draw. What's this ghost name again? Over? Anthony, can you hear me? Uh, Anthony Norris. Anthony Norris, I'm standing in the kitchen all by myself. Can you hear me? Anthony, I, I know you wrote something. What do you want to say, Anthony? Hi, Jen. Anthony, what did you have to say? You can say it now, dude. Nothing on the spirit box so far. Let's throw that down. We've got icy breath. Do you want to check freezing temps? The notepad says, help me, please. Can't hear you. The notepad says, help me, please. Jay, thank you for my goat, for my hats and my mustache. Rising inflation, we don't. So you're telling me not to read too much into it, over? Yeah, I think it's fair. I think it's open for interpretation. That's a lot of salt. Yep. Um, yeah. I think I have most of the stuff. Did you step in the salt or did the ghost? No, it would the, only the ghost can make an imprint. So okay, you know, we have a footprint a right there. Yeah. Yeah, you want to take a photo of it? Uh, we get money for that kind of stuff. Oh, I like money. So our ghost has one foot. <laughs> We're looking for a one-footed ghost that needs help. Also, oh. I dropped the black light, and I have no idea where I found it. It's right there. Well, I think we should go out. Uh oh, run, Robert. Hey, Robert, out. Yeah. We're good. Yeah, that was. I think we should go out and look for the dots or the orbs. Yeah, I think we should. Let's, uh, let's skillfully and very... Let's walk, it, let's walk as slowly as we can to go yeah, look for this. very fast manner. <laughs> um, I have less than he does. Uh, okay, so we got ghost orbs. You see it? Um, yes, I see the orbs. Only ghost orbs. We have orbs. We have ghost writing dude it could be it's we're literally in the same it could be a thay it could be a revenant or it could be a mirror 
Oh, let well, me go back in. Well, let's do the dots because that's what we had last time. Yeah, we have we have dots right there. Oops. Uh, it's kind of in a bad spot. Let me go rearrange it. Okay. I'm going to set in here and worry about you. <sighs> You're doing a good job, over. Thank you. Did you take a second one in so we had more? You turned off the camera over. Uh, did I? Oh, I got it back. Okay. Cha cha sliding right out. Yeah, I'm playing with my oldest son, Robert. It's such a big room. It's hard to like. Do we have both of the dots things in there? Yeah, I'm going to. I think I'm going to double them up instead of like that's such a wide area. I can go do it if you want. Okay, we can, we can go together. It's no worries. Right behind you. I'm gonna this one. He left me. Hello, 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 hello. Okay, the thermometer is right at zero, so it's not freezing. We have EMF reading, but it's not hitting a five. No, it's okay. It won't hit a five because we don't have the right um, evidence for it. All right, I think we're good now. Get out, get out, get out. Okay. You look a lot like Zach. You look a lot like Zach, Robert. I look a lot like Zach. <laughs> you do. <laughs> I wonder if this is how we found like like open listing. Yeah. Uh oh. That's not super cash money, but this one's pretty good. Still not great. Just so it's such a hard one to put dots in. Do you want me to go in there and hold it, and you can look for it? No, I mean I wouldn't be able to really see it. Well, then have patience. You have to sit here for a minute and look. Okay, okay. No, there's no way <laughs> that you have all people were telling me about that. I'm just saying, patience is a virtue. Oh, that's terrible. Which one's that? That one's on the kitchen table. Yeah. I'm thinking. It's, I wonder if there's no way to like angle it up, huh? From there? Yeah, like like angle the dots thing, cause like I kind of wish it was. He is trying so hard like, to behave. Um, in an easier location for us to do it. Well, should we have one on the kitchen counter, like by the sink, and then the other one on the kitchen table, so that way one's going on. I'm just on. worried that like it's so like in the room, like the. The dots itself in the because this open area kitchen is so hard. How about this? How about you stay here? I'm gonna walk around with the dots. You let me know what's a good angle for it, and then we, we can play this. This like it realistically it hasn't dusted yet, so we're pretty okay. Oh, it did touch the door. Hey, Robert, look for prints on the door.
What's going on? Did it talk to you? Huh? Did it talk to you? Over? Yeah, it talked to the three of us. Oh. Oh, very cool. What did it say? Huh? Yeah, well, like, I mean, you can go in and talk to it again. Nope, I'm all good. I believe you. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, you have I do. That was our happy dance. Good job, good job. Good job. Look at us. I know. We're like professionals. Yeah. I know, Andy. It's <laughs> pretty cool. Well, do you want to do like one more that's not Willow Street? Okay. I mean, I mean, you don't have to if you don't want to. No, no, it's fine. It's fine. We can do one more. All right, then pick either Tanglewood, Edgefield, or Ridge Court, or Ridgeview. Do you want to do one that you haven't seen before? Ooh, yeah. Okay. How do we do that? that? That's not unlocked. Because uh, it, it's locked on my leader, end. I'll pick it. Yeah, I'm the party leader, so I pick it. It won't let me pick it. It's fine. I already picked it. So you just got to ready up on the board. Like, like not that board, not the vote on the street, but like the, yeah, that one. That, yeah, I got it. Yeah, he does. Ooh, Sunny Meadows. It's, it looks scary. So this is uh, it's an insane asylum. <gasps> no. How many rooms does this one have? A lot. Oh, so you wanted just to end this one with a bang? Yeah, we did have something cool. All right. This one we're going to have to be like super omega, like crazy good host ghost hunters. Uh, we're looking for a Jennifer Mowdsley, so she's British, and okay. she responds to everyone. Look at the, you know, if you notice, you know, like when you start the game, you pick up the keys. Look at the keys on this map. Oh, dang. That's so cool. Yeah, isn't that cool? Yeah. Let me know when you're ready. I'm ready. O only cats matter. Right, I play it by game. myself all the time, and it's so much fun. I'm ready when you are. I mean, you have to get the, you have to crack the keys. <laughs> <laughs> I got him. I remember my flashlight this time. Oh, jeez, right, Robert. Yeah, crazy, right? So now, do we stay together? It's such a big place. I, I would say, yeah. This side, you want to see something really cool? Yeah. Oh, I think bells piss off ghosts. Oh, yeah, totally. What do you have? I have my EMF reader. I have the EMF reader and a um, camera. And I have the spirit box. I have some lit candles over here. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a sacrifice room. Oh, great. Over. <laughs> What's that noise? What's what? That's you using the walkie talkie. Oh.
is a good, uh, wait, can you go back here? Oh yeah, so this would be a good hiding spot, I guess. I have a feeling if it hunts me, I'm just gonna keep running. <laughs> That's the hard part's figuring out where you ran to. <laughs> is that Louis Vuitton? No. All right. How many rooms does this one have? Uh, dude, I don't know. Like a lot. I don't know. I don't even. I forgot to look. To be honest with you. I would say like maybe like three or six rooms. Dang. So many rooms. I know. And it's got uh, it's got two stories. I think t at least two or three. Of course it does. Anything pretty scary though, huh? No, it's de definitely creepy over. I think I'm lost over. You're, you're not lost, you're just, you're right in front of me. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go in the next room over. I think we're just looking for one ghost. Is there any oh can is there any way we can turn on the electricity or Yeah, yeah, we'll have to go back to the trailer to figure out where the switch is. Okay. If if we need to do that we can. Oh well, that's terrifying. I'm in a little back room over here. Do you see me? It feel like a real ghost adventure. Oh yeah, it really does. There's there's a there's a hiding spot right here if you need it. Okay. <laughs> I'm crouched down and I'm looking at your butt. Okay, okay, great. <laughs> let's um let's head back to the trailer for the ghost. Okay. How do you find your way out? Just um, memory, I guess. Ah, oh, thank you, Candace. So there's the creepy altar room. Oh, but nobody went in here, Robert. So hold on. I'm checking out the altar room. Hold on. Piccolo, thank yeah, you for my rose. All right, so the ghost is starting to become really active. Okay. And the breaker looks to be. Okay. Oh shit, I thought I was outside. Okay, so keep going straight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're out. Okay. Phew. <sighs> um, I just whatever character I end up being, that's just who I take. I did not like that room either.
Where are we going? We gotta go turn on the brakes. Will that piss them off? Uh, it won't really piss it off. It'll just be a little bit more easier for us to see. Okay. Where'd you, hold on, where'd you go? Where'd you go? I can't find you. Oh, there you are. Right. Okay. So the breaker should be in this room right here. Okay. Wow. I'm very impressed. Wait, the, I forgot that the, <laughs> I forgot it amateur, the power's always on. <laughs> the breaker's always on. And like other difficulties, the the power is tripped as soon as you walk in, so you gotta find it. So we have power now. Well, I'm still impressed with your your navigational skills. I mean, yeah, yeah. a map. <laughs> so we've already been here. Let's go downstairs, yeah. Sure. So the ghost has became really, really, really active, and we didn't get any signs of it. So it makes me think that he's not in this section. Okay. So I think he's either downstairs or, or in the other wing. Okay. I forgot to turn my EMF reader on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we might do. You might get a little bit more of a reading with that. Well, I'm just impressed that he knew where even to go. Nothing down here. I'm going to try the other room right next door over. Gotcha. I'm walking around. I'm walking around over. It sounded almost like um, like moving of like a filing cabinet. I hear that. I hear that. That's not me. Oh, this doesn't look good. Kidding. Did you close the door? I opened a door, I did not close one. I'm hearing things over. It's, it's creepy, right? Yep. Oh, I'm going right in. Yeah, hold on, I'm finding you. Yeah, let's take it, I guess. Okay. Mm. Kind of crazy, kind of different from all the other houses, huh? Uh, yeah. So we're still on the first floor. We're just on the other side of the wing where we started. Since we haven't seen any activity, I think it's in the back area. Because we've been pretty thorough in this front part. Okay.
So I think we find we find our way back to the entrance and we work our way to the back of the building. Okay, I'll just follow you. Oh, there's the altar room again. Hey, Robert. Yeah. I just get the slightest reading in the altar room. Like, it's like maybe one or two. Okay. I mean, it would be really convenient for us if this was in here. Harley, this is called phasmophobia. It's definitely moving, not much, but it's definitely moving. Yeah, Sage, as soon as we, we get this one, we're gonna um, play in sound mine. Do you have the thermometer on you? No, I have a spirit box, but it does look cold. It doesn't. I mean, this is a a pretty good sign. What's the ghost's Let name again? It is Jennifer Maldonado. I can try talking to her really quick if you want. Yeah, you want to give her a little ring? Jennifer, are you in this room? That's what I was thinking. Jennifer, are you here? Jennifer, you need to give us a sign. Jennifer, don't be shy. Come on, you can tell us something. Jennifer, can you hear me? You need to say something. Jennifer, I think you're in this room. So would you like to say something? Jennifer, yeah, need to, you need to say something to me. Jennifer, why are you still here? Jennifer, you need to get going. Room's creeping me out. I'm gonna go explore the back of the building. Let me know if you get any time. You well, if I'm not, if do you want me to go with you? Yeah, you should be walking you. Did you want me to go with you over? No, no, stay in that room. If you're getting a feeling in that room, I would say capitalist. The only room where we also saw our breath, so it's a it's a pretty good sign. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to the um, thing and I'm gonna I'm gonna get some more equipment and then I'm gonna bring it back in here over. Okay, over. All right, let's go. I'm going all by myself and I'm scared. Okay, so I think it's this way. Oh my goodness. It's gonna Indy get down. Yep, there we go. Sorry, dude, that's not the time to try to jump on your mommy. I didn't turn the furnace on. Okay, so let's grab one of those. Let's grab shit. I should have left the spirit box in there. That was my bad. So let's get going. Let me put this right. <gasps> Jen, thank you for my corgi. Jen, thank you for my corgi. We will put this here. Okay, we got that. 
Let's go ahead and put this. Ah, Angel, thank you for my cheers, my heart, and my team bracelet. Thank you, everybody. Jen, can you hear me? I just left a notepad. You need to write on it. Okay, so let's go. Let's go get the thermometer. Jen just sent out some subscriptions. Jen, thank you so much. I appreciate you, Jen, so much. And I went the wrong damn way. Oh no, I think I'm lost. Jen, thank you for the subscriptions. And I just got turned around and I'm lost. Okay, there it is right there. So if you just got a subscription, that was a gift from Jen. What was that, over? I, I can't get a sign or a reading anymore. I'm going back with the four thermometer, over. All right. Um, let's take the thermometer then, I guess. And maybe a camera. I just don't know what else to do. Uh, Shante, thank you so much for the follow. Tippity tap user um, 660868647. Thank you for the rose. I appreciate you. Thank you, Jen, so much. I appreciate that. Okay, so we don't have any writing. Was that, that's new, is that new? Was that always there? That is new, isn't it? Hey Robert, can you hear me, over? Yeah. You need to get, you need to get back here. We have some, um, some interesting stuff going on in here. Well, I have a big old um, trail of blood. No, I think, I Over. Think yeah, that's new for sure. Oh, that's not new. I saw my breath. I don't know, y'all. I still think that looks new. I think I would have. I think I would have seen that. I think it's new too. If we can see maybe some orb. Now, would we be able to see the orbs on the camera? Yeah, I know. It's like, has, what was that, Robert? Over? I, I can't find a single thing. Yet. Oh, okay. I mean, I don't, so, it's up to you, and I don't want to keep you all night. So that blood right down there is all new 
or it was, was there. So Robert, this whole blood trail was o always there? Huh? Oh, um, sorry. Was that blood trail always here? Okay. Yeah, it was always here, yeah. Okay. Uh, I was going to say, I don't want to keep you for too long. I mean, we just guess shade because it's a shy ghost. We can do that. Okay. Because I just think, you know, I don't want to uh, eat up your evening. Nope, that's perfectly fine with me. Because I, I, I mean, I walked this entire asylum. I didn't get a single EMF reader. Yeah, because I've been, um, I, oh, the door's shut. The door's locked. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, I'm panicking. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, I, mean, I would rather have a shoe. Look how active it is. And like, I just. Is it just in one room and we're in the other? Yeah, it's what it is. I think it's in a very particular room. Oh, it's just, I, I'm going to guess spirit because they're like the shy ghost. Okay. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Um, there would be which one's the shy one? Shade? Yeah, the shades. Okay. Um, and the I mean, you can pick whoever you want. I mean, like it, we're literally just taking a shot in the dark. Do I need to um, put anything for evidence? No, because we don't have any. We can't All right, find any. I circled shade. Well, let's see what it is. Oh, you did have a friendly one. That's the cool. The most boring thing is we didn't die, you know? I like that. Uh, oh, that was a ride you. There was no, I mean, there's just nothing we could have done with that. Well, at least we didn't lose any money. Very true. So a ride you was... EMF five ghost orbs and dots. So we would have had to have found it to place our stuff to get it. Yeah. All right. You live and you learn. At least you get to see a new map. I like it. I appreciate that. Yeah. No worries. No worries, Ma. All right. Well, I want to jump out. Uh, all good right. Luck with the rest of your stream. All right. Thank you. Bye, Ma. Bye. All right, so what we're going to do is I'm going to go toast my Uncrustable, and then we're going to go play some In Sound Mind. Yay! Thank you, Just a Disney lover, for my TikToks and my hearts. All right, I'll be right back. I'm going to go toast this. because I also have my banana. All right, that was fun. I absolutely love that game. All right, let's go do some in sound mine or in sound mine. We made it pretty far yesterday. I don't think my banana is ripe. Wasn't that fun? I had a good time on that one. All right, Megan, I record everything and I put it on YouTube, so I will have that one posted tomorrow. That was fun. Oh, how fun. Tell Brandon yes. Just to text us and we will do it all together. Oh my gosh, that's like my dream come true, Jen. How fun. All right, I'll let Robert know. Awesome. All right, I'm going to grab my own crust double.
Okay, Angel. This is the Nutella one, and I'm eating it with a banana. Okay. Mama Bear, Mama Bean, how do I tell someone they hurt my feelings? You say, um, you hurt my feelings. There's nothing wrong with telling people when, you hurt, when your feelings get hurt. And if that person doesn't understand and say they're sorry, then there's something wrong with that person. Okay, Janice, go heat that up. We're gonna play some In Sound Mind, or In Sound Mind. Ooh, Taco Bell. I love Taco Bell. All right. Let's do this. I haven't had a Sloppy Joe in forever. Then you don't need friends like that. Okay. Oh no. Breezy, I'm sorry that sounds so painful. Hello, I'm her. All right. So we started a new tape last night. No, we started a new tape. We started a new tape and this guy has anger issues. Oh my God, that Nutella with banana is so good. Well, honey, you should always feel comfortable around the people you're with. All right, let's get these guys. Yep, and that's how we do it. Okay, so we're on a new tape, and this guy, like I said, has anger issues. How are you doing, possum? User number 660-86-864490. Um, you need to get that person out of your life. That's like a... That's a no contact, just ain't gonna happen. You never need to speak to that person again. I'm doing good. I've just been absolutely loving this game and having a lot of fun with it. Okay. So now, yeah, just because they're family doesn't mean that they're a good person to have in your life. Point blank, end of story. Let's get going. Okay, it has to be something in here. Period, end of story. I'm 
thinking. I guess up and over and out. Because it said to follow the track. Okay. Thank you, Angel. I was just about ready to say that. Let's see what we got. Okay. I was gonna say, yeah, a lot of words might not let you be, li might not let it go through. Okay, let's keep going. Stay out of tunnel. You definitely, um, you should definitely go into the tunnel. Okay, we're going into the tunnel, everybody. Let's get going. Or something. Yes, you can. Oh, I love that. I love naps. Naps are always required. I didn't think I was going to fit through there. What the hell? What the? what I thought I was going to be fighting. Oh my goodness. No, nope, it was definitely the... It was definitely the flare gun. That was one angry thing, whatever that was. <sighs> what the what?
This is definitely a harder level. I think with each tape it gets harder. Possum, thank you for my roses, hon. Hello, Lexi. Hmm. I'll have to give that a go because I don't have enough flares to actually finish it off. But I will definitely do that. It's not done yet because otherwise the music would turn off. You're, I think you might be onto something about the eyes though. Are you at the end or just meeting Max? Um, I just started. We haven't even met Max yet. Barbara 876, thank you so much for sharing my live. Lexi, thank you for hearting me. TJ, my day has not been bad. I am not going to complain. Snow White is so your phone it, your phone broke. Is that what happened? problem is is that's not gonna not a bullet I think I need to do okay I can I'm stuck Yeah, I accidentally dropped it in water and the screen went black. No one. Oh. What kind of phone was it? Hello, Anthony. Oh, you have to run from him? All right, we're running. Okay, I'm running, I'm running. Oh shit. 
guess he can get off the railroad tracks. Okay. Okay, so he broke that. This is called um, in simple. It's called in sound mind, and it is such a good game. I've had so much fun playing this game. I have a feeling that's Max. That's are the guy that was on the tape. <laughs> okay, so that is barricaded now. Ah, <sighs> oh, Mads, I'm glad that you're here. Lexi, thank you for hurting me. Thank you for my team bracelet. Sky, thank you for my finger and my tiny diny and my pink shoes. I appreciate that. Tina, thank you for my team bracelets. Thank you so much. He's still here. I have no idea what I would use to even stop this guy. Lexi, thank you for my team bracelet. Okay, I think we're good now. Or not. There he is right there. I thought he broke this one down. Ooh. I know, I know. I should have kept quiet. It's still there somewhere. There's the power station. Sky, thank you for popping in. I appreciate you. I told you he had anger issues. Ah. So does anybody, um, <sighs> do, do, do. So let's go get him and then we'll start back over. There's a key somewhere you have to have him break the warehouse. You can't get in the warehouse. Okay, that's what I was thinking. Um, so I'll just keep running around and having him break down the warehouses. Got it, got it. There he is. Oh, 
Oh no. It says find a way to defeat the bull. So I have to figure out some way. So I want him here. Okay, so now let's go back down. Is there another one here? Maybe I can get him to break this one down. Okay, this guy's just big and scary. At least I got in here. Okay, there's our friend. I can't carry any more of this. <sighs> that was stressful. Where is the phone? There it is. Okay. I see you've met your old pal Max. Or what's left of him. I wouldn't say it to his face, but... I did it. You really should do something about those anger issues. I told you he was going to have anger issues. Definitely not Granny. Um, there we go. There we go. We updated TikTok. Thank you, Patrick. Of course it is. So let's go see what we can find. Let's go see what we can find. Let's go up. We're going up, everybody. Fixing the loading platform to get to the second floor. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, let's take a look. Oh, we need to go up. We need to get whatever's up there. An electrical indicator. It's off. Well, shit, we need a screwdriver, everybody. We need a screwdriver from last night. Yeah, Mad, that's what I was thinking. It's blocked from the other side. So I'm wondering, here we go. It says, this door is to remain closed during lure pill experiments. The last thing we need is for livestock to ram their way into the hangar during operating hours. One belligerent former employee was enough. <laughs> so what this is about, this is a, um, I am a psychiatrist, and these are, basically, I'm living... Um, I'm, I'm fighting my patients, um, kind of like, uh, their memories, their, 
their phobias, everything that was, what was wrong with them, I'm fighting. I guess that's what it is. No dice. So let's go. Yes, you do. So where in the heck are we going to find a screwdriver? Maybe up here? Well, I needed that, but that's not what I needed. That's what's hanging? Oh, okay. So somehow I have to... How am I going to get up there? Because I have to fix... Hello, Hannah. So I have to fix that, but I can't fix that without that, but I need a screwdriver to fix that. An electrical indicator. It's off. It has no power. An electrical indicator. Looks yes, like dude, I know. Oh, very, very cool, Cole. I wonder if I can jump. Oh, 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 I think I can grab it if I do it just, if I do the right timing. See what I mean? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Let's try it again. Got it. <laughs> I got it. All right. Let's see what we can do here. chip in there seriously we need to find a chip now gosh darn it it's not okay it's off I should an electrical indicator it's off so I wonder if I can jump up there Nope, I don't know if I can do that. Nope, it's not letting me. Let me try one more thing. Let's try one more thing. Let's try one more thing. Oh, I can I think I can unlock the door from the other side using my gun. I think that's what I'm going to try to do. Okay. All right, all right. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Oh shoot, there was one more, 
We're just gonna go back up and down. I'm running out of bullets, though. Old Man Hotline, how are you? Such a good game. Such a, such a, such a good game. All right, let's see if... Let's see if we can't go around now and maybe get in on the other side. Go, Lonnie, go! Go, Lonnie, go! Uh-oh. He's very scary. All right, let's see if I can't jump up somewhere. Nope, nope, and nope. So nothing's here. That is our patient kind of like <laughs> kind of manifested into a monster I guess is the best way to put it okay so I'm thinking I probably need to stay in here I just wish Blocked from the other side. I still don't think that there's any way that I can jump in there. I wish I could. I'll try one more time. Out and left? Okay. Because I went left, and then I got... Because I think that's the only door. Because that... I think... All right, out and left. Thank you, Betsy. Oh, that was even more left. Got it. Yep, that was a ramp. So I need a, uh, I just need, s oh, I got a chip. Oh, okay, I got the chip out of here. So let me see what I can get out of here. Let's see if I can't get this. is too weak. Right. It has no power. Maybe I should look for power cables. So, I'm going to Okay. So, power cables. Let's look for power cables. Uh-oh, here comes crazy guy. Ah, 
Zamir, yes. Yes, 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 yes. So let's see what we can do. See what we got here. It's a metal plate attached to the wall. Yes, it is. You know, I was thinking about trying the chip at the one on the inside too. I could plug a chip in there. There we go. So that one worked. Uh oh. Uh oh. See, because I was thinking. <sighs> I was thinking that I needed the chip it's for in not. here. It is very entertaining. Grab chip. Well, let's go back and get the chip. Let's go back and get the chip. Because, you know, there's just nothing like running around with this crazy train here. Okay, I got the chip, everybody. Let's go. Let's get back in there. Yeah. A chip in there. Yep, and that's what we did. So we got this, and it says, Hi, is your name Gary from Electrical? No, the don't touch the damn electrical panels. I know every elevator is wonky. I'm working on it. So take a chill pill or whatever it is you guys make around here. I'm revamping the electrical distribution for the entire facility. So there will be times during the day that when the elevator won't get as much juice as it needs to blame the power situation for frying all the lower end conduit chips to the point that I have to keep switching chips from different panels to get the damn elevator to climb to floor number one. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Mads, thank you for sharing my live. Thank you. It is. It is. It is. Okay, so now I have another chip. But... So it says find a three volt chip in the power station. I could plug a chip in there. No, I have a one volt, two volt, and I need the three volt. Okay. No, I haven't seen those comments. Let's it's blocked see. from the other side. Hello, Brinny. Mm -mm -mm. Pez, this is called um, In Sound Mind. The quarry to toxic dump. And that went over there, that went over there. I already did that. 
Let's go. Oh, I know. I could plug a chip in there. No, so I took that chip. I took that chip. This one. 72,000, holy guacamole. I like, I mean, truthfully, I like the music. It, it definitely goes with the, the tension that I feel. Oh, here we go. So I, it's definitely fitting for these chase scenes. That goes, I got that open. So now let's take this back out. Okay, so that was the two vault. Oh, I get it. That was a one vault. He had irrational, this guy had irrational anger issues. So it's not so much his fear as he's just extremely angry. Extremely. So that's the power station. So I need him to chase me over into there. Okay. Nothing like having a little bird's eye view to figure out where you have to go. Mads, thank you for sharing my live. I appreciate that. I appreciate you. <sighs> so I need him. Oh, but he couldn't get past this, remember? Hmm. What do I want to do, everybody? Oh. What I think I need to do is I need to get these things to go down so then that way I can okay I need to figure out the electrical issue over there that's what I need It very well could be. He was just not a very, he was not a very nice person. I mean, for whatever reason he has his anger issues, he just wasn't really very nice. So what we have to do is somehow, I need to fix. I need to fix. I need to fix this right here. That's the one I need to fix. And you see right there? Do, 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 do. Cause that one, that one, and that one. Okay. So let's go ahead. I could plug a chip in there. Nothing happened. Oh, I don't have this enough. Work. Oh, maybe get this one. Nothing. Let's 
rats. Because looking at that, because I need that to, to lower that so I can get in there. Pickaloo, this is called in sound mind. Oh, okay, thank you. chip in there good thinking oh my gosh you're a genius good job okay so let's get that back out now now we can get him to chase me in there I have my chips right yes I do okay Let's see if he'll chase me this way. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? I need him to follow me. There you are. Heather, it's definitely, you know, I've, uh, it's kind of cool because the more I play these games, the more I kind of understand the whole puzzle concept behind it. And I absolutely love them. Hello, the real queen. That should bring him over. There he is. Here he comes, everybody. Ah! Oh, no, no, no. Come this way. Damn it. I thought for sure he saw me. And now he saw me for sure. This guy is irrationally angry. All right, run, run, run. I don't know where I'm running. I'm just trying to run away from this guy. Oh, I see it. All right, let's go, let's go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Just gonna hide right here for a minute. <sighs> I'm doing well. How are you doing? Goodness gracious. I would love to get in there, but I don't think I'm going to with that. I could put on my gas mask, but I don't think I'm going to. Yeah, I just don't think I can get up that high. See, because there's just nowhere for me to... Yeah, that's a big old box. I'm not moving that one. All right, let's go see what we can do in here. So I have to turn something on for that. Let's see if I can't... 
get over here. Um, good, good luck, I hear. I'm good. Uh, very tired. Laugh out loud. Glad to catch you, though. We'll stick around for a bit. I love it. I'm glad you're sticking around a bit. You know, I think it's been a little bit of a lower energy day for some reason. Um, nothing bad. Just seems like, again, just kind of a lower energy day. Here we go. Let's use the screwdriver. You know, and, uh, and like I said, it's not like I'm depressed or anything. I just woke up tired. All right, let's do it. I think the chip I used is too weak. All right, let's put the second one in there. <gasps> Yay! Chris, thank you for my corgi. Uh-oh. I have zero bullets. Okay, I don't know what... Oops. Oh, I think we have some shotgun, don't I? Okay, so it's off. I, I should look for wires. Well, there's the wires. <laughs> you took your own screenshot. Did I get my chip? Yes, okay. Let's see if I can't find another one of those. <laughs> oh no, Chris, this is called In Sound, um, In Sound Mind. And it's a really good game. It's just a really long game. I think I've been playing this longer than any other game I've played in a very long time. Okay. I've seen Destiny, but I've never purchased it. Is that a pretty good game also? Ha, ha, ha. Let's go ahead and put that chip back in. I could plug a chip in there. It seemed pretty cool. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that lights that up. It has power. Yes, it does. Let's see what we got going on. Let's look around this way. We'll poke around that way. And we'll look around this way. Hello, Taylor. How are you? Okay, I know I need to get in there, but I also know that the door is going to be on the other side, and I cannot get to the other side until I do something with this, and this is that, but, hmm. Oh, I'm not too sure. Um, that one was fun. That was called uh, Fear to Fathoms, and that was Carson's House. So I'm not too sure. Usually I never really know what games I'm going to play until I start set down to actually go live. So I'm not 100% sure. Okay, I made it over here.
didn't feel good, but I made it over here. Oh, I died. I'm doing good today, Liz. How are you? Let's see what we got. Aw, thank you for my, ha my hat and mustache, and thank you for my hand heart. I appreciate you. Thank you so, 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 so much. All right, so let's see where we go. Grid, how are you? Okay, so I know we have to unscrew this. So let's use the screwdriver. <gasps> you bought your first cologne. How cool. Which one did you get? <laughs> Heather, yeah, it gets a little, um, it gets a little, in little at the very end when um, she's talking to you. It gets a little, it gets a little scary. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. Oh, so they're the ones that screwed that up, and then he's still mad out there. So let's try a different. Nothing happened. So let's try. Okay, so that's back on again. Hmm. All right, Cole, have a good night tonight. Oh, very cool. I'd love that. Angel, this game is super interesting. Oh, your bed broke. That's crazy. Oh, no. So. I'm thinking... I was very loud. Do you know what I mean? He was very loud. So. Oh, okay. That's what I was thinking, TJ, but the only thing I have, I can try using a flare gun, but that's not going to work. And I was thinking that maybe he would have to do something, but I don't know what. So... Because I have all of the... I wonder if he's coming back. No. Nope. Okay. I will be here on... I will be here tomorrow and Thursday. But hopefully I see you on Thursday. I would love that. See, because I can't jump up in there. And even with that on, that did not do anything. Wait, okay, so when I turned that on, everybody, that door over there opened up. So let me take this and see if I can plug it in somewhere over here. But I don't see any place to plug that one in.
I just can't get in there yet. So I don't know, because that opened up, but I see absolutely nothing I can do with this one. Except turn. Don't see anything there. Still think I have to turn. Put the chip in there. Okay, I think I'm supposed to do that. No, I can't go in through the window. It has metal bars on that one. Okay. Because it says, find a way to defeat the bull, fix the loading platform to get to the second. Oh, I'm looking for the 3V chip at the power station. So that's basically why I'm here. What if you tried to disable the coils on top of the little buildings? Can you shoot them? I sure can try. I can. Oh, but they come back on. We are playing in sound mind again. And then I'm not too sure what we're going to do. Not a hundred percent sure. Eighty-seven thousand guacamoles. Holy guacamoles. Can I jump up there? Nope. That's a lot of guacamoles. See, but there's no way I can get past that. Oh. And it's not showing me anything here. See what I mean, jelly beans? Isn't it weird? I love that. Oh, I can run through it. Oh, I thought it would kill me. Uh-oh. Oh. Look at me go. So. They kind of... Uh, we're making progress now, folks. We're making progress. Except I think I need to go back. This doesn't work. I left my screwdriver <gasps> in there. Not my screwdriver, but my chip. Yep. Okay, so that's what we have to do. We just have to break through there. Keep a tap, tap, tap in, to tap, tap, tap in. Good night, dancing queen. <sighs> yeah, 
you know what? I'll put that a little electrical shock. It's not that big of a deal. Okay, so let's do this. Yeah, it's a little electrical shock. So we're going to put this one in here. Then these people are going to come over this way. And that took care of that. Okay. <coughs> Let me take my chip. And we're going to go over this way. I'm going to get what's there. We're gonna go this way. Oh no. Guess it didn't work that time. Got it right here, Betsy. I am, Lizzie. I'm doing good. But thank you. Let's see here. This game always takes a lot of concentration. And that one. I could put a chip in there. Let's go that one and we'll put that in. to try to get past that. So let's try. And let's try this. Oh, you just got um, Thai food. Oh my goodness. What kind did you get? What kind did you get? I know, we are all just really jonesing over there. Ooh, mango curry and pad thai. That sounds super yummy. I've been looking for a good Thai place around here for, for such a long time. I have been wanting some pad thai, uh, no, um, Tom Kai soup. Okay, so we got that. Except they can't get through there. So we're good on that now. So let's see if we can't blow that up and see if we get anything there. Well, damn it, I did forget the chip. Yep, I did. Mm, I had a great Chinese place in Seattle. It took us almost a year to find one here in Chicago. I have, it seems like, I don't know. It just seems like I find really good ones and then everybody else finds them and then they don't be in, they're not as good anymore. So let's get that. Do not let me leave without my chip. Oh, that would be awesome. Where? 
Alright, he's all irate over something. Okay. I got the chip. Let's go here. And then these people are going to come. So let's go ahead and grab this now. Let's blow this up just to see if we have anything. Nothing. So we're going to keep going. All right, so let's go ahead and do the screwdriver on this one. Screwdriver on this one. Screwdriver on this one. And screwdriver on this one. Um, the, ob chip in there. the objective is, is we're trying to solve a... Oh. Um, we're trying to solve a mystery as to... Um, what happened to his patients. So it's kind of like an adventure mystery game. It's actually really fun. Okay, so, oh, better not do that. Keep on doing that. Okay, so we have to find the th three volt one for that, but See what we can do. Root and toot and point and shooty. Let's see what we can do. Oh, maybe we can get into the office now. Let's see if we can't get in here. Nope, that would be too easy. Where's the darn door? That's not the way to get in. All the good stuff's in there. But we cannot get in there. Ooh, let's try this one. Let's try this one. I could plug a chip in there. Yep, that one works. So now. Okay, we're going around this way. Let's see if we can't get this to work, everybody. We got stuck there. Got a little shock, nothing bad. Let's see if we can't find, I really want to get around, get in. Oh, did we get in? Did we get in? Uh, this is definitely a ramp. Oh, can't touch those, by the way. We did. I definitely, I made it to the RV. Finally, it took me forever. But I made it to the RV. Okay. So no touching. No touching the live wires. It's on, um, I actually, I, I can't remember what day I did it. But I believe I have it on YouTube if you wanted to check it out. It's one of, the, I think it might be on the 13th. Oh, look how angry he is. Okay, so now we have... I 
that. Maybe I... Let's get going then. Hopefully I can make my way through there because I thought they... Nope. Um, no, I'm not really so much in their head. I'm more in, of like a dream state, I guess. I'm like in a different, a different, um, kind of like a different plane, if that makes any sense. I don't 100% sure if I know if I'm doing this right, but it's the farthest I've gotten doing something like this. So let's go. J yeah. Um. Oh, maybe I can jump over the fence instead of like trying to. You think you I am? Okay, Megan. Thank you. Okay. So I need. Take the chip out. Let's go. So let's try going up, going up. Let's try it again just to see. So go up, go up, go up. Okay. Nope. Hmm. Good night, Emily. I will see you tomorrow. It's that, um, it's Max, he's like, he took the form of a very angry train and he's outside the other side of the fence. He's out there. Okay, so let's go, let's go, let's go. Screwdriver, screwdriver. Screwdriver, screwdriver, okay. So we got these people coming and they're gonna run into, oh. Okay. That's really weird. That's like a little burning piece of him. Okay, so I got my chip. Now let's go. Um, let's try this way. Let's go up. Let's go up, 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 up. Look at us go. All right, everybody. I think we're on to something. This is a lot better than getting electrocuted. Lonnie Parkour again. So now... I'm going to go... Okay, and I want that, so let's go ahead and do this one, 95, one to Betsy, that's awesome, thank you everybody for all the taps, thank you I'm for, sure there's something behind it, I think I can get this loose, I think I can get this loose, okay, 
and use the screwdriver like I'm telling you to. That's right, damn it. I could plug a chip in there. Okay, that I one, I need a three one for that one. Okay, so let's make sure I have both of my chips. Yes, I do. Okay. Okay, I got that. Not bad. Not bad. So let's try... How should we? Let's try this. <laughs> Lonnie Parker, Monica. How are you, Monica? Monica, oh, Monica. I love my Monica. She makes me happy. She makes me happy. Oh, Monica. All right, let's do this one. Monica, oh, Monica. I'm doing good. Uh, oh, I found, um, I really think you would like this game. It's called In Sound Mind. I was going to, um, I was going to text you about this one. And then I found one called, uh, oh gosh, we played it yesterday. Shoot, I, what game did we play yesterday, the new one? Um, hold on, I'll tell you. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We played... Mm -hmm. I can't, Fault Stream, yes, that's it. We played Fault Stream. I think he would really like that one. I think that's right up your right up your alley. I think he would really like that one. Let's see if I can't jump up, jump up. Good night, Cole. Oh, there you go. I was going to try to sit there and jump on that. There we go. Except... I don't see any way... Unless I, oop. There we go. Mm -mm -mm. Nope, I forgot the chip. Got just a little shock. But let's get the chip and we have the chip. All right. 100,000 holy guacamoles, everybody. Thank you for all your tippy tapping. Thank you for the tippy taps. Okay, so now this one, I need to definitely get up here. Oh, I hate when I have to walk on scaffolding. <gasps> Those sneaky sneaker sins. No matter which way I go, no matter which way I go, they're going to turn on. Thank you, Angel. 
absolutely you can, Cole. I am sending you my hug right now. <laughs> that was a nice big, that was a very tight hug. And we'll do a hugging emoji also. Tara, I'm sorry, honey. I, I, um, you never have to say sorry for, for being away life happens i absolutely love you and i i'm glad you're here all right we're in yay we're in i love you too honey i'm glad you're here and you know what not to make light of anything because everybody has their own you know nobody somebody else's pain doesn't make your pain any less but it just seems like it's been a harsh start of the year and i just hope everybody can stop and just take a deep breath and just be okay for a moment and i'm really glad you're all here thank you serene i appreciate that Sarah, thank you for hurting me. Patrick, thank you for hurting me. Good night, Cole. Katie, thank you for hurting me. You know, I can't, I can't fix, I can't fix everybody's problems, but I sure as heck can give us a, a safe space to hang out and just breathe. And I really hope that you all can do that. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Casey. I appreciate that. <laughs> well, I don't know if I'm the best gamer, but I probably have, I, I probably love my stream more than anybody else. Thank you, Jen. I love you, honey. You're very welcome, Daisy. Caitlin, if you um, continue to have those severe stomach pains, I think you should probably go get checked out. You've had, um, you, you haven't had the easiest go. Nope. Oh, I got the chip. Okay. Mel, Mel, thank you. Melly, Mel, thank you for my roses. I appreciate that and for hearting me. Good. Well, Heather, I appreciate that. Thank you, Heather. It's my, it's my honor to be here with you all. I think it just keeps ringing. I think it's just a way for me to to advance into the game. Lily, how are you, honey? Thank you for sharing my life. Okay, we got lots of bullets. Yeah. Do you like my shooting stance? I'm all like, it's all right. on it. They're very aggressive. Oh, Nalia. I've heard, I've seen that happen. Um, I don't know if that's painful enough, but I'm so sorry about that. I, but you know, that's just the whole thing. It's, it's like, it's so weird because, okay, 
So here's the thing, everybody. I'm going to give you a little bit of my mind think, my little I'm mind back. space. I don't do New Year's resolutions, all right? I don't do like in this year I want to do this or this year I want this to happen. I don't do that. But what I did and what I constantly remind myself of is that I told myself going into 2024, I wasn't going to, um, I wasn't going to stop myself from succeeding and I wasn't going to, I wasn't going to be my biggest obstacle. And even though things can be shitty and I still sometimes, um, you know, shit happens. I remember my promise to myself and I'm not going to let myself stop myself. I'm not going to let hard times stop myself. So just remember, it's, it was a little bit of a rocky start, but we got this. There's so many. <sighs> oh, it very well could be the stomach bug. That is everywhere. I can't carry that much ammo. Oh, okay, that's more ammo there. So I think I want to reload. Oh, okay, even with them. Oh, that's right. Because then they'll run into the little things. Good oh, thing. Glad you're here, my friend. You're not getting it, wheels. I think it was this one. I could plug a chip in there. There we go. If I stick around this thing. They got me. Okay. Yeah, and I need to blow up those um, barrels too, but that's what I need to do. I need to put all of them in. I need to do the one, two, and three and just keep them at least, yeah, at least we know now. Exactly. 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 That's what we need to know. I, that voice sounds so familiar, except I can't place it.
I'm just gonna run from them. more of them because I can hear it. Shit. Holy guacamole, everybody. I think we did it. Okay. <sighs> All right, let's take my chips. I worked very hard for these chips. Let's take them. Let's make sure I got them. Okay. Thank you, Tara. Yeah, we worked really hard for these chips. Let's go make sure that we grabbed everything we need to. I wish I had more bullets, but I don't, so we're okay. Oh, Bella, thank you, honey. I'm sorry your back doesn't feel good. Okay, so now Get back. Go, go, go. Let's get go, 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 go. So now we can use that number three. Oh shit, what the hell is that? What the heck? Guacamole. Pretty good. <sighs> that was not fun. Okay. I mean, it was fun, but. I could plug a chip in there. Let's do the three. Okay, so then. Nothing happened. Oh, you know why? Because this one, we need to put this one here. Ah, sorry. Ah. Yep. So now let's go upstairs. Oop, where am I going? All right. All right, we made it up here, everybody. Finally, I know. Okay, I can't wait too long because I'll run out of good air. Ooh, what's that? Uh-oh, this guy again. Niger just wanted his job back. If you had done yours, perhaps he wouldn't have thrown such a tantrum. Because that's all it is. The whiny tantrum of a man unable to control himself. Sounds like my ex-husband. Control is the name of the game. You figure out how it's played. Yeah. 
You know what? It's such a good game. I have not seen anybody else playing it here on TikTok, but it is a really good game. Not bad. Good. I'm glad you like this. Okay, this says experimental lure pill ingredients. Um, that's the big machine in the next room. It says tubed liquid compounds are in to be placed in assignment. Um, Jennifer or Jenny Lynn, thank you so much for my high bears. I appreciate that. Uh, good night, Angel. Oh yeah, Tara, absolutely. I have two more that we have to play. Uh, that's the big machine in the next room. Okay. That's the big machine. The find the big boat machine. We've got this is such an incredibly long game. Um, as renovation work continues on our brand new distribution center, we are still in the process of removing and repurposing machinery and equipment left over from the quarry. Do not attempt to use any of them without proper authorization as improper use may lead to injury or even death. Ask before using anything you're not familiar with. There you go. Okay, we will be here. Okay, so I have to find the Bolipo mix on the first floor. Then I have to find the Tripo something mushroom extract on the second floor. And then the Tripo something mushroom exact ricus on the third floor. So we need to go look in um, for some stuff, believe it or not. Put that back on. Oops, not yet. So let's put that on right now. Oh my goodness, edible cookie dough, that sounds amazing. That does sound really yummy. on everybody ah, I just died the flower I did not know that I would sit there I would eat the whole thing uh oh come on put your mask on dude Bond right there, which isn't good. So let's go see what they were trying to keep me away from. I did not know that. Yeah, we progressed him. We got out of the little, like the light socket place. We got out of the light socket place. That's spawning me in a very weird place. Aaliyah, 
yeah, it's everybody. I think everybody's having a fairly decent night. Thank you. That's what it feels like. I got through the death loop. Let's see what we can find. I was, I was, um, the only thing I had left was a flare gun. Ooh, Marcia's husband found a salted pretzel caramel ice cream. Um, for me, oh, that does sound good. Okay, don't need that. Let's go over here. Let's reload. Half baked, though, that sounds good too. See, now you all are making me hungry. Usually it's the other way around. you guys I think we're gonna switch it on over and we're gonna do some granny I'm just feeling like playing some granny tonight so hopefully you're not scared of giant spiders or tight spaces because we are going to be in both of those so let's play some granny and then um, yeah that's a fun game, but it's hard to concentrate and also talk to you at the same time. Yeah, we're just gonna end with some granny. All right, let's play. She was, she's been on a tangent lately. I have just had the heck of the heck of his time with her. Good night, Lizzie. Good night, Tiffany. Grand Zizzle. I love it. So let's go ahead. Yeah. Um, Taylor, I have I haven't done Exit Eight in a long time. I found some really cool anomaly games. I just um, I just usually start with those. So let's see what we got going on here. There she is. So we have time to come over here, move some boxes, make a run for it. There we go. Is Jen going to bed? Oh, yeah, no, that was um, like, it was like Station 5. No, I've never gone back and played that one. That was so crazy. Okay, cool. I thought I saw somebody say goodnight, and I thought, I was like, oh, Jen's going to bed too? See, I'm telling you, she's all up in my business these days. She's just all up in my business. She just seriously needs to get a hobby.
She just needs to get a hobby that's not chasing me. That's what I think, but she thinks something different. You know what? I would try it again. I would play that game a lot if they fix the bugs. And I still have it installed on my computer, just hoping that they figure out that they just made it so difficult. I mean, I think it's a really cool concept. They just need to fix it so we can play it. That's my, that's my opinion. So there's gasoline there and a key there. Huh. Frog lady, um, as far as hobbies go, I don't have a whole lot. I don't have a whole, whole lot because I don't have a whole lot of time, but I would say hiking and photography are two of my favorites if I ever get a chance to do that. You know, I couldn't even get off of, I couldn't even get out of the station. It was no fun. I mean, literally, I was just like, oh, uh-oh. I was just like, nope, this is not fun. She'll be coming down here now. So let's check this really quick. Oh, she was right there. She was freaking right there and she didn't come all the way down. Ah! Oh. Sorry to be asking you about, but do you play Endless Suburbia tonight? I did, Heather. And I freaked out because there was freaking spiders in my car. I was like a spider Uber. There was, for some reason, I turned around and there was freaking spiders in the back of my car. Yes! And it was crazy. And I have an immense fear of spiders. So that one hit like pretty much that one hit home. So I, I'm not 100% sure what I think about that game yet. So I, I have not decided if we're going to keep that one in the rotation. They were, no, 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 on the game, on the game. In real life, I'm scared of them. Um, but in the game, they were just like giant freaking passengers in my car. And then I have an immense fear of thunderstorms. Of course, they had a thunderstorm. They had a tornado. And it just, to me, I couldn't figure out how to, you know, how to maneuver my, my way around them to make it fun enough to play. Ooh, hot dog. We got the shotgun. You know what? And here's the thing is I have an immense fear for spiders. I will, if I find a spider in my house, I will get a little Tupperware and I will escort it outside. I won't kill it unless it's a black widow, which it terrifies me to the point of wanting to throw up. So <clears throat> what game is this, Jenny Lynn? This is called Granny. And I'm stuck in this psychotic lady's house trying to get out. And I have five days to do that. And now I have a shotgun. Um, yeah, and that's just the whole thing. It's, it's like this, this game itself is hard enough because there's like a, a granny spider in the attic, which, or no, the basement, which I can get around that. That doesn't bother me at all because it's like a cartoon spider. And I'm just like, whatever, it's not real. But it's the spider in the attic that gets me every time because it looks the most like a real black widow. So that one is not my friend. I do not like that one. Um, you rehome spiders outside? Yeah, you know what, to me, it's like they're not like in my house trying to cause mayhem, but I don't want them just free roaming around the house, uh, you know, um, I don't want them free roaming without supervision around my house. So I will definitely um, accompany them outside. Yeah, Jenny Lynn, um, 
my grandma grew up, or she's from Arkansas. No, Georgia and Arkansas. So whenever there was a thunderstorm when I was growing up, she was like freaking out. And I spent a lot of time with my grandma. So I got a very good fear of, of storms from her. You know, I don't, I'm not opposed to shooting things into a video game. Um, oh, they freak you out, the daddy long legs? See, they, and I've heard they're really poisonous, but their teeth are too small to actually pierce your skin. But daddy long legs don't scare me, just the black widows. Yeah, no, I just, and here's the thing, I'll even see like really dark rain clouds and I start to panic. I'm just like, this is ridiculous, but it is, you know, it's a phobia that I deal with. And I just go along my merry way. I go. Really, Jen, see, I thought that they, if you Google it, but I thought, um, I thought that they were super poisonous, but they just don't have long enough teeth to bite you. That's what I thought. Tara, yeah, no, we were, I saw all the news clips from um, San Diego, and I got a lot of rain yesterday, but I got nowhere near that. And also, too, I saw all these fake TikToks about, like, all the flooding in San Diego, and I'm like, Dude, that's not even San Diego. They were just taking clips from other places and saying they were San Diego. Okay. Yeah, let me know what it says, Jen. So, I mean, I know that they did have flooding because um, I actually watched the news, but I just think it's so funny how people are like, I'm just going to make up stuff just to put it on my page, which, again, I find honest, find weird. Honestly, I don't mind big snakes. I like the um, small. Oh, you like the smaller ones? See, my mom had a complete terrorizing fear of snakes. It says that it's common myth that they are poisonous, but they are harmless. Really? Well, there you go. We, we debunked a spider myth tonight. We debunked a spider myth. There you go. We learned something new today, everybody. And I like that. Tara, nobody can drive in the rain, period. And I went out on Sunday because Indy needed some more food, and I just wanted to go grab some soup. And people were rude and they were mean and they couldn't drive and i'm like oh my gosh why is the rain bringing out the worst in people we have to keep an eye open for our number too so for when i go down to spider city i will know what um, number box to open up so keep an eye open for a number yeah and let's run around run around we're gonna run straight on up and let's go really quick and let's go over here okay we're armed again Yeehaw. Okay, we can get that. All right, let's just wait for her, maybe. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, I know she's... She's sneaking around here somewhere. 
Shishnika. Otter, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate you. There she is. Just because it's oddly satisfying. And then let's go do this. Jump, jump, jump. Oh, let's just get out of that. Let's do this. What the heck? Why can't I move? Oh, because I'm in the trap. Dirt. I know, did you see that? Her little bloomers were sticking out. Okay, we gotta save some bullets for upstairs. So let's put this right here. Remind me where I put that. And let's go grab the screwdriver and see what's down here. Yeah, she only, she's only down for a couple of minutes, and um, about a minute after you pew-pew her, she just disappears. Yeah, on granny, like the newer grannies, it's a double-barrel shotgun, but this one, it's just a single barrel. So let's go down, oops, let's go down here. Let's go down here. Oh, shoot. So chances are she's going to hear that. So we are going to keep moving. Because I don't want to take a chance of her jumping on me. TJ, I've been playing just for a couple of minutes. I'm still on my first day. Still on my first day in Granny's house. That's a really fun game, but it's a it's a game that requires a lot of <gasps> master key. Yay. It requires a lot of concentration, and I feel like I couldn't really talk and play, so I switched over here for a while. Why do you pick up new things then leave them? Because they only have one use. You know, like, for example, like this master key. Um, I, I'm only going to be able to use this in one spot. So I'll put that right there. And then I'll keep moving. So, for example, like this thing right here. I'm only going to be able to use it once. So once I use it, I'll just keep moving. And that, my friends, goes right here. And this is the slowest thing. <sighs> Myra, is that how you say, is it Mariah? Mariah, thank you for the follow. So you put it there before you use it? Yeah, I mean, and for example, like I've been putting the keys right, like these little things right here. I put that there because once I open the door, that's where I'll be using it. So I'm just kind of putting the stuff that I know where I want to use it once I have everything all collected. So it's kind of a little strategy of mine. So that way I don't have to keep on running back and forth. I just put it where I know I'm going to use it next. So for example, I want to take that hammer with me when I go. I want to put that there because I, ugh, spider. Mm, I don't like this spider. This is the one spider that scares me. The granny spider doesn't scare me. This one scares me. <sighs> you don't have inventory in this game. Mm -mm. You have to remember where either you found it or where you store it. But you can't carry, you don't carry everything around with you. 
Yeah, if she is us, then I would wake up to day two, and then day three, day four, day five, along that way. Okay, there's a spider upstairs where we're going to go, and there's a spider, um, mutant spider. There's a mutant spider um, down in the sewers. So I'll show you where, oh, there she is. So what we're going to do is we're going to do this. And it scares me because it looks the most like a real spider. So let's go up, let's go up, let's go up. It's up here. So this key right here is for this place. Oh, that scared me. I thought that was her. And so I've made a lot of noise, so we're going to look and see if she's coming up. Because if she comes up, then I'm going to jump down. Yeah. <sighs> oh, see, here she comes. So let's go down here. I'm really quickly going to look in here. And what I want to do is I want to run back down and I want to get my shotgun. Oh no, my shotgun's upstairs, huh? I need my shotgun. So let's go back upstairs. Except I do need this. Because I need this hammer for upstairs also. But let's see if I can't do something tricky first. Let's see. Oh, there she went over there. So I'm going to come here. I'm going to go. She's right behind me. Got her. And I feel absolutely no empathy for her at all. All right, everybody, here's where my icky, icky spider is that I absolutely cannot stand. And it scares me, so let's do this together. Okay, it's this spider right here. But we can put it in, we can lock it in there and then see what's in here. That's for down in Spider Town, so... I don't really care for that one. So let's drop that. Load up. And then what I would like to do ideally is to find her again. Let's go here. And you can just see its front legs. And that's enough for me. It looks enough like a black widow that you can just see its front legs and it scares me. I don't like it. It is not okay. So let's go here, here, here. Let's make some noise and put that down here. Okay, I have my shotgun here. And just want to make sure that she's not coming in here. Oh my goodness. Okay, a pair of cut cutting pliers. I will actually need those. So what I want to do, because she always catches me doing this next thing, I do want to find her and um, pew pew her. So then that way she doesn't sneak up on me. That way she doesn't sneak up on me. 
Sage, um, I probably would, but I actually hire um, an exterminator to spray my house once a month. So then that way I don't, because otherwise we do end up with a lot of black widows. And it's like, I'm so scared of them. I actually pay to have them sprayed. Even, I, I just have a preventive thing. An eight-legged Stanley. Uh, just see the front legs is more creepy than the whole spider. Yeah, don't you agree, Jen? I think that's a really scary one. You know she's around here somewhere. Yeah, nope, I have, like I said, they're, they're my, they're my fear, so. Okay, so I have to hurry. What I wanna do is I wanna load this up just in case. Oh, I guess I had a, I just stompled over her. So what we're gonna do here, everybody, is we're gonna come in here we're gonna get the cutting pliers. And then we're gonna walk over this piece of wood and we're gonna get whatever's in here. And this. Okay, so I do need this. So let's put this in the bathroom because I do need that. And we're gonna go back and get this. Okay, and let's get that. We're gonna come back. We're going to do this. Yay for us. All right, let's get this. So this is basically everything that we need to do up here. Lance James, thank you for the follow. Yeah, I'm cool. I mean, really, truthfully, the only poisonous spiders that we have around here are the black widows and then the brown, those brown recluse spiders. But I don't know what they look like enough to know if I, if one came up on me, I wouldn't, I don't, I don't, I'm not familiar enough with it is what I'm trying to say. So now I got the weapon key and the reason that I switched out the shotgun for this is because this one is reusable. So I can shoot her and then pick up my dart and then shoot her again, which I personally appreciate. Okay. Is there, is there lucky? Uh, um, I know that there's like, there's like real ones and then false ones. And yeah, no, they're, they scare me. I mean, but I don't, I don't know what it is. It's just something, like I said, I have a real phobia about the, um, the black widow. And I never had a real fear of spiders growing up. It's just something that I have developed later on in life. Okay, where is she? I winged her. Okay, so what I wanna do is I've been waiting for her to do that. I thought I saw, where did I see the book? I know I saw the book somewhere. Hmm, where is that book? And I still haven't found the number for when we go down to Spider Town. Weird. What movie, um, that movie scared me for life for, Ara oh, Arachnophobia. Yeah, that was a creepy one. That was a good movie, but that was definitely, oh, there it is. So remember, I threw that there because I do want to run this upstairs while she's out and do this. Now this grandma here 
that we're going to be releasing is the spider that we see. The spider that we see downstairs, that's her. So what I want to do is I want to put this here because I need this here. And I want to go get my dart gun. I want to go get my dart gun here and my dart and figure out where Granny is. <sighs> Oh my gosh, yeah, no, I would freak out. So Robert always, um, he was in some caves in Indonesia, and he was in a cave in Indonesia with, he said, um, spiders that were so big, he almost threw up when he saw how big they were. And I was like, no, thank you. I wonder where she's at. Kind of bothers me that I don't know where she's at. Oh, here she comes. Don't know where she's at. Oh, here she is. So now I'm going to take this and I'm going to do that and I'm going to do that. And Let's take the car battery and put it in the car. And let's go do that while we can. Let's go do that. Okay. We can put the gas in the gas cap while she's out. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Okay, um, I always run her over. She doesn't deserve, I mean, she don't deserve me to not be, to be, for me to be nice to her. So I have the gas in there. Okay, there's a couple of things I want to do. One, let's find our, okay, there's the dart, there's the dart gun. Okay, so I know where all the pictures are. So let's go ahead and I'm making all sorts of a racket, but that's okay. So when you get all the pictures, when you build that picture, you actually get an extra day. And this picture is here. So let's see if we can't sneak that down there. And where am I going? Where am I going? Okay. There you go. Okay. So now Yeah, Tara, that way it just gives me an extra day to put everything together. I'm still on the first day, Sage. Psycho Chef, my day's been good. I, um, I mean, I woke up with a little bit of low energy today just for, I don't know. I don't know if I'm fighting a stomach thing or what, but it's been, um, it's been a good day. It just, like I said, I have a little bit of a low energy day, so... Um, Nothing bad, but it's been good. It's been good. I've been here. Everything's great. I love my beans. And I got nothing to complain about. How was your day? How was your day? Oh, shit. That scared me.
Okay, everybody, I'm going to run upstairs and grab something. Oh, you know what? We still don't know what the number is for when we go downstairs. Has anybody seen a number one Ooh. or a number two? Oh, good. Okay, Jen. Not good that you guys had stomach aches, but yeah, because Robert had the actual flu, and I have just been having no appetite, and um, kind of my stomach didn't really feel all that great earlier this week. But I got, again, nothing to complain about. Darn it. Darn, 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 darn. Darn, 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 darn. Darn, darn, darn. Okay. So let's just go on down. Now, again, if you're scared of big spiders or tight spaces, um, watch with caution because both of them are about to happen. <gasps> Throwing up is my, I, I, nope, I do not. Oh, number one. Yay, we just found it. Okay, we got that. So let me go back and where is it? Where is it? Where is it? It's right here. Mm, mm, mm. Noise, yeah. Noise. Jay, thank you so much for my ice cream cones and my lightning bolts. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. And that would be the spider downstairs. That's downstairs, spider. Um. Oh, no, Tara. Yeah, Lucky Tay, like I said, that's not, she is not my friend. And she just creeps back. Hello, Freddie, how are you? Um, Sage, when we go upstairs, um, there's like a little elevator and we have to pick a box. And if we pick the wrong box, it um, blows up. And that's not a good thing. What was that giant piece of meat doing down there? I'd never seen that down there before. Seriously, what's that doing there? That's weird. I've never seen that there before. Ooh, the playhouse key. Okay. So let's put this over here. Yeah, I saw that. I get a warning every time I play Granny. You know, and I've just learned to just be like, well, you know what, if that's, that's, um, they have the right to do that. And if they think that it needs a content warning, I'm perfectly fine with that. It's, yeah, I know. I've never seen, I know, whoa, I know where it's from. I, I just have never seen it down here in the sewers. Heather, I think that the reason is, and because the, the warning that I see, it's because you can watch it on your full screen. And it tells me that since people are watching it on the full screen, that they feel that the content is a little bit more graphic when you can see it at larger, I guess. But the thing is, is that we'll play for about 10, 15 minutes and it goes away. It comes and goes, it won't stay on. Because I watch um, other people's streams all day long just to get like ideas and stuff. And I see people playing um, the Mortuary's Assistant and um, they don't have any content warning on theirs either. And that's way more graphic. Okay, I don't need that. 
So, I mean, it is what it is. I'm not terribly upset by it anymore. When I first got those warnings, it really upset me because I thought I was doing something wrong, but I'm not. <gasps> Elizabeth! Oh, there's two spiders. Um, remember the, the granny that I that I, um, I released that was hanging up there? She turns into the spider downstairs. 120, Betsy, good job, Captain Tippy Taps. You're doing awesome. Yeah, no warning at all. And like I said, when this first started, hap when this first started happening, I kind of got a little upset, but I, I don't get upset anymore. You know, it doesn't, um, oh shit. Oh gosh, that scared me. Oh, my Lanta. That freaking scared me. I cannot believe that we got around that. That was Grandma's spider. Yeah, lucky dude, that gave me a heart attack. Dude, did you see? You can always see when I get scared because my mouse goes, <laughs> and that's what it did. Ugh. But I'm okay. We're okay, everybody. We are okay. All right, so we have both of those. Let's go get the key. Shay, wink, um, Shay, thank you so much for my roses. I appreciate that. So that was the spider. It has a face. Yeah, it, it was. Okay, that is the lady who's chasing me, Granny. That was her sister that she turned into a spider. Don't ask me why. Don't ask me how. That's just what it is. So again, I don't know how or why. It just that's what happened. It is traumatic. <laughs> exactly. You know, it's kind of like, hey, what do you want to do today? I don't know. I thought maybe I would just turn you into a spider. Oh, okay. How about it? So that's why I've been putting these here, because those go here. And then that goes here. Ooh, and that's our spark plug. So this is for the car. Uh-oh. I don't think she can get me in here, can she? She knows I'm in here, though. Look at her. I've never been caught in here before. She's right there. <gasps> if I had it gotten out any sooner. All right, everybody, I'm going to go get some more water and take a quick bathroom break. So get some snacks, get some water. I will be right back and we will play some more granny. So I will be right back.
let's do this. Oh. Now let's do this. Uh, da, da, da. Hello, Libby, how are you? All right, let's do this. Do, do. You ready? Yay! All right. I was going to be upset if she was waiting for me. I got a little um, a sugar-free gum. So that way I can chew my gum, not grind my teeth, it's kind of a sweet little snack, but it's not going to um, fill me up or make me feel icky before I go to bed. Yeah, but today seemed like a little bit of, like I said, a little bit of a low energy day, but we're all here and we're having fun and that's what matters. I would, have, um, I would make, you know what I might do tonight? I might just treat myself for a little cup of sleepy time tea and I am not sure maybe we'll I'm in no hurry to to sign off tonight so maybe I'll make myself some tea and hang out with you for a little bit longer I am still on day one I probably jinxed myself but I'm still on day one How's your stomach feeling? And if you have any mint tea or ginger tea, definitely drink that. Um, sleepy time tea, I have that. I have a hard time going to sleep. Does that help you, Heather? Libby, thank you so much for my rose. Oh, goodness. Oh, la, 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 la. So I know um, we actually, we no longer have our content warning. It's so weird how it pops up and then goes away. Yeah, Jen, I bought some of that at Barron's the other day. And I was drinking that. I was drinking that when I wasn't feeling good the other day. I'm just wondering how many times I'm going to say the other day. The other day, the other day, the other day. I'm so lost. Oh shit, she got me. She got me. <laughs> you asked for it and there you go. It's you, we can see her. Oh, melatonin, does that help? Cool. Bella, uh, she's not my favorite, but it's still that one spider that looks like a black widow up in the attic. Absolutely scares me the most. 
So we're going back down, everybody. We're going back down. I thought I was going to be able to backtrack on that, but nope. Oh, you do, Jen? So is Brandon off tomorrow? Is that why he wants to um, play Phasmophobia? Now we need to find that damn key. Okay, let's just go here. Have you played the back rooms? I have. I haven't really found one that I like a lot. Oh, very cool. Awesome. I I wish, uh, oh, number one. Um, ooh, watermelon. I think it's going to be fun. I, I really am looking forward to that. Um, so what we're going to do is, uh, I, I have been playing Security Breach, but I just downloaded Five Nights at Freddy um, number four, which I think we might play that one here pretty soon, just because, oh, there it is right there. Oh, okay. Hurry, 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 hurry. Go, 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 go. Whew. Uh, I think we're going to play um, number four, too, because I've got the part on the security breach I can't get past. Mm. Chris, thank you for sharing the live. Thank you for sharing my live. Jen, what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to get you a computer also, and then we can all play together, all four of us. And we'll be the best ghost hunting team ever. Okay, so that's that. I don't, I want to see what's in the watermelon before I make, before I decide what I want to do next. Vinti, are you, um, which videos are you talking about? Because I'm still posting TikTok. Mm. What always gave me really super wild dreams were um, when I was smoking, when I would try to quit smoking, I was wearing, I wore a nicotine patch. Man, that was crazy. Crazy. Oh, you went off social media for a while. Well, welcome back. I'm glad you're here. And you know what? That's, I think everybody needs a break every once in a while. And I'm glad that you took one. I'm glad that you were listening to yourself. I saw where she went. Run. Get down in the hole. There you go. Hello, Sarah. Hello, Egg. How are you? All right. Let's see what we have in the watermelon. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. I'm doing good, Egg. It's been it's been a fun night of streaming so far, and I definitely got a second wind, and I've had a lot of fun playing Granny here, and it's been it's been a fun night. I got no complaints except I almost ran to the wrong place. Almost ran to the wrong place. Not gonna lie, I realized this was a jelly bean. I feel slow. I knew it was a bean, but now here's one. It's a jelly bean. It's a jelly bean. Okay. So let's go ahead and put this here and that. Padlock key. Okay. 
So now I'm pretty sure we can get out the front door. Shut the front door. So what I want to do is, okay, let's think this out, everybody. I would like to put this here because I'm going to go over here. We're going to shoot her. Day two. I'm on day two. So let's go ahead and I need these here. Okay. So what we need to do is we're going to cut this. We're going to use that, and we're going to, what? Why can't I use that yet? What am I missing? What am I missing? Oh, okay. Got it, got it, got it. I'm just ringing the bell like a thousand times. All right, let's see if we can't get out before she gets there. We did it. Oh yeah, that pissed her off, all right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to try doing a little bit of Granny the Remake. All right. I, yeah, Carson, um, anytime I play Granny, I get a, a I do get a, a, a content warning. Yes. Okay. I've never played this more than just a couple of minutes. Libby, thank you for my good game. So this is going to be very interesting for both of us. Um, alternate watch. Yes, Jinx. I have been my, had my eye open on that one. And it's just, I have to download it off of some, off the different website than what I usually use, but I've heard about that one. Lucky Tay, thank you for sharing my lives. I know, doesn't this one look good? Oh, it wasn't made by the original con. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. So, the little bit that I played... Oh, no. The bell's definitely louder. Oh my gosh, that scared me. It's definitely creepy. What the hell was that noise? try audio that was very loud okay 
Yeah, you and me both. Okay, so now I know I have to take one of these. And then I'm going to go... I don't think I would ever want to go to sleep if that was my alarm clock. Okay, so let's, what the heck is that? Oh, that's a tire. Don't think I need a tire for anything. Okay, what the heck is that? I need to unscrew all the screws. This is the remake. This is the granny remake, and this is the first time I've playing this. Nothing in there. I have... Is that her right there? Oh, I thought that was her right there. So it, the house kind of looks the same, but it's kind of different. Ooh. I'm hiding. Yeah, this is, this, it's definitely different. Dr um, there was drama about this version because people who made it, uh, like ripped off the OGs I heard really how could they call it the same thing if it was it's like um, it's like granny the remake you would think that they would have to like um, get permission to do that I don't know I mean I'm not an expert on like copyright laws but I would think that they would have to at least get permission Oh, the bathrooms are definitely cleaner here. What is that? Is that like a big poo? Oh, I can hide a lot faster. Oh, look at there she went. Oh, okay. Good night, Venti. Have a wonderful night, and I'm glad you're back. Oh, wow. Well, that's kind of cheesy, I think. I saw, um, speaking of copyright, I saw um, a new video game that I was looking at that looked just like um, Five Nights at Freddy, but it was like Winnie the Pooh or something. I thought that that was a little suspicious. You know, instead of Freddy, it was Winnie. Oh, that's kind of cheesy. I, I feel kind of like, um, I feel kind of shitty playing it now. So is Granny, um, Granny 2 and 3, is that like a regular? That's from the same people? Oh, I don't know if I like the tunnel. Yeah, Janice, um, it's because I'm playing, uh, it's because I'm playing uh, Granny. Oh, dang. Oh, that's right. Disney lost their patent, didn't they? If you collect the pieces of the painting, then Granny may give you more time. Okay, 
see, there's a tomato. I don't know why I have a tomato. Am I going to throw a tomato at somebody? So I wonder if there's a car down here, too. It's an electrical box. A very loud electrical box. Very interesting. Oh, I didn't see that one. Look, I can jump. It's definitely darker. Um, Oh look, now we can now we can see everything. It's a very large oh goodness, they have a spider here too. Oh, there she went. Uh oh. Ha. I think it's a hundred years, Jen? I'm not a hundred percent sure. Yeah, I didn't even see it. No, it has to be longer than that because Disney's been around forever and they just lost their patent. Oh, I knocked. Oh, there's cans everywhere. It's 100 years. Okay. Oh, there I knocked another can around. Let me, let me just kick all the cans up here. Oh my gosh. How could she not hear that? Oh, there she is. It's 95 years, okay. Okay. So this is questionable. I think I like the first granny better, but we are going to play a, a new game. And I started playing it today and I wanna play the tutorial with you. <laughs> Allison, thank you. I wanna, um, I, I definitely like the first one better. So I want to try this out with you and see what you think about it. So I really want your opinion, whether you like it, whether you don't like it. Um, yeah, it was a little, it was a little glitchy. I did not care for that one. Yeah, I don't need, I don't need that flashing in my face. Uh, Granny can just whack me over the head and I'll be good to go. No, this one is, okay, this one is kind of like Phasmophobia, but we have to actually learn the ghost's backstory. So we have to figure out why the ghost became a ghost. Nope, no dolls. Uh, so let's go play, and we're gonna do the tutorial. Okay, and it actually, I'll, I have to, it will hear my microphone. Yeah, so I thought that this would be a good thing for us to try out together. No, this is, Allison, this is brand new. I have not tried this one. So since it's a tutorial, there's a lot of writing on here, but um, we'll figure it out. It says, let's get started with your training mission. 
um, an entity is haunting this place. One of our agents has placed a barrier around it to keep it from escaping. Your job is to go in and send this entity to the afterlife. Uh, to do this, you will have to understand what happened to it when it was still human. Let's get started, investigate the place, and try to find some clues. Okay, so we have to find notes left behind and find objects that are interesting. Hello, Ke is it Keegak? Hello, how are you? Lucy, Lucia, thank you so much for the follow. Okay, so let's open the door. Oh. Let's open the door and let's check the settings. Um, doo -doo. Sensitivity, the graphics. Okay, we have it turned up the whole way. Okay. I can turn lights on also. Okay. So this one is called. resident something something i don't know what was this one called again shyly thank you so much for sending out a subscription to monique i appreciate that egg thank you so much for the follow uh, if it's any good i will let you all know the game name tomorrow let's well, I, rim oh thank you allison <laughs> i'm glad you're paying attention yeah remnant records no i don't think it was resident i think it was remnant Oh, 1,700 subs. That's amazing. Thank you, Charlie. <sighs> but I, you know what? User 32979106460029, you were way closer than I was. I was like, it's called something something. Okay, so I need to find a key for that. And... I need to open this door. Okay, so we got a bathroom. Sad, thank you for hurting me. I appreciate that. Um, we got a bathroom. Nothing peculiar. So we're looking for clues as to why the ghost became a ghost. And we're trying to piece together its life while it was still human. Yeah, I usually stream until about anywhere between 11 and 11.30. So we will, I'll be on for some while longer. I've already been on for almost seven hours. So let's go here. Ah, Monique, that's awesome. Okay, so it's good for a month. The subscription cost is $2.99 and it's good for a month. And then after that, if you want to resubscribe, you absolutely can. And welcome to the Bean family. Yeah, Egg, I stream for anywhere, um, usually about eight hours a day, uh, seven days a week. Because this is my job. This is what I do for a living. This is on Steam, yes. So if it's any good, you can jump over there and get it. It's not super expensive. Okay, so... It says, it feels like I've woken up from a bad dream, um, like the addiction has possessing me, but I'm done. I'm never touching it again. I'm begging you, give me another chance. You're the love of my life. Um, okay, so he's having marital, marital, marital problems, and he's writing his wife. So do, 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 I will gloss over some of the writing if it's a little bit too sensitive just so we can keep the story without getting super graphic because i never want to um i never want to like trigger anybody or anything that's because i'm very sensitive like that <laughs> you and me both my money management skills are not that great but i do try okay it says get close to the fake ghost okay so we're gonna get caught by real ghosts and i'll have to fight my way from the real ghost and then 
So that's what we'll do when it's a real ghost. We're playing a tutorial for a new game to see if we like it or not. Um, okay, so this one. Squeak, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate you. Okay, that was something that was interesting. So we have that. We have creepy ghost, creaky, creepy fake ghost. Let's look at here. Yeah, I mean, it has potential. So long as it's not like super cheesy, this might be a fun thing to play. Because like I said, it's kind of like phasmophobia. But instead of just figuring out what the ghost is, we're trying to figure out what happened to the person in real life to make them become a ghost. So I think that that's pretty, I think that was pretty cool. Okay, so now we've been in here, right? Yeah, we've been in here. Yeah, Tiffany, you know what? I um, was very intrigued by the premise also. So we're playing the tutorial so we can see if we like, um, if we like it. Um, ooh, they need to look up and clean the light bulb. Yeah, you know what? I don't think the tutorial is going to be super scary. I think that probably... Um, probably like the um, that's locked I would imagine the real game will be scarier than this but I'm perfectly okay with it not being super scary so we can learn how to play it that's what I'm thinking so nothing here Chris thank you for sharing my life Thank you for sharing my life. I appreciate you. Thank you for sharing my life. Oh, that's where it was. Okay, so this talks about him um, thinking about... <laughs> so I'm going to leave it at that. Now, the only weird thing about this one is what is that oh he had a beer and he had that so let's go excuse me fake ghost so we're gonna go into the locked garage and that's how you use the key. Not super fancy, but I can deal with that. So let's turn on the light. It is a ghost key. Yeah, I know, Kinsey. And I think that that's what happened right there. So we're going to kind of gloss over that fact that it looks like that's where he, the, um, he became a ghost in this room. So let's keep going and see what we can find anything here. Now the only thing I can, oh, what's this? This wasn't here when we came in. So let's go ahead and pick that up. It's kind of a weird candle thing going on here. Um, oh no, Jamie. 128,000 hot dog hot diggity dog okay investigation grade trainee ghost trainer ghost grade this is a harmless ghost John Doe a man from Eastwood was found deceased here we suspect this place being haunted though we have no proof yet someone needs to check it out and report back special condition no roll abilities our target's name is John Doe Okay, I appreciate um, it seems the fuse is blue. Well, that would be a ghosty thing to do. Turn the fuse box back on. All right, turning the fuse box back on. 
Yes, our ghost's name is John Doe. Good, now let's start the, oh, the exorcism. Gather the objects you think are mostly closely related to the ghost and bring them to the exorcism. <gasps> oh. Okay, can hold up to five objects, but don't try to cram as many objects as possible. Sometimes one will be enough. Once everything is ready, light up the candles depending on the color of the light. We'll know whether or not you succeeded or not. Oh. If it fails, you'll have to wait for the candle to stop burning to try again. Oh. Um, light. Is that where I put it? Okay, drop objects you think. So I'm thinking this thing right here even though it's a paintbrush. Um, and then this right here, I think is probably it. Did I leave it? Oh, I left it. Where did I leave it? Where did I leave it? Where did I leave it? Did I drop it? Where in the heck and heck did that go? Behind the door? I threw it behind the door. No. That's weird. It was just, I didn't unpress my button either. Oh, there it is. Okay, got to walk with it carefully. And there it is. Let's go put this here. Okay. Okay. That was weird. What happened to that? Oh, drop objects on the table to link them. Press E to unlink them. Press E to hold to light up the... Oh, okay. So now where did that go again? I am having a heck of a time holding on to this. Oh, oh. So that's that. So now press E to light up the candle if you encounter a problem. The light's red, that means the objects you choose are not good enough. Oh. Those circles that appeared on the table indicate how, appro how approximate. Red means bad, white means okay, blue means very good. If everything is blue and still fails, it means you're missing something. Oh, okay. Okay, because I think I'm going to try. <gasps> oh, yes, I did. It's asking me to bring the, um, the beer can. Okay, and. Okay, so. All right, I got it. Hello, Katerina. Fanny Banny, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate that. Beer and the, the paintbrush, yep. Okay, so the paintbrush is right here. So we have that, and then we saw the beer thing was over in the room with the fake ghost which was around in here yeah excuse me fake ghost so let's go let's go take that 
Yep, I got the brush, and now we got this. So let's try it again. There was a mention of a portrait um, our target seemed to be obsessing over. I have the paintbrush. Let's see, because if that's the case, I, the only other thing that we could pick up was over here. We could pick these up. So let's put these here and try again. Oh, so that's a wrong one. There was a mention of a portrait that our target seemed to be obsessing over. Hmm. So I got the paintbrush. Maybe it's a picture. Maybe we need to find a picture. But I don't remember seeing a picture anywhere around here that I could pick up. Mm -mm -mm. So that was the note. What is this? Oh, that's one of his beer bottles. We don't need that. Oh, can we take that? Oh, I guess I can. Oh, wow, we're going to take the whole picture, y'all. But I want to get rid of this. And let's try lighting again. Complete. Uh, the lights are blue. This means you succeeded. Now you just have to finish the exorcism. You can either wait for time to tick or explore around and find a way to excel the process. Every ghost will behave differently during the exorcism and you will have to use different ways to speed it up. Oh, during the exorcism, ghosts are especially dangerous. Stay on your toes. Okay, that looks like a one. How would we speed it up? Good night, Daisy. So it's a dangerous ghost. But I don't know what we would do that would actually speed this sucker up. So let's, oh, it's in here too. Uh-oh. So that completed uh, our finding a way. Hmm. Okay. Oh, maybe I just walk through it like that. Uh-oh. Now there's... The soul of the ghost has been chained. Now you have to perform the access. Okay, pressing E, okay, good job, the ghost gone, you've completed the training. What did you think about it? However, do not think that this was enough to, however, do not think this is enough to, real ghosts won't let you do whatever you want like this fake one did. 
if they see you or hear anything, be your voice or your footsteps, your life is in danger. Be careful out there. Head to the entrance to leave. Do you want to try a real one? Do you want to, uh, I mean, we can always try a real one. <laughs> Daisy, you're scared. Okay. Yeah. Um, let's try it. All right. So let's go. Good night, Chelsea. Head to the entrance. Okay. Tutorial complete. Congratulations. You completed the training mission. You're now free to take on any contract by yourself or with colleagues. Good luck. So let's go close. Let's create. I don't want to. I want to play alone, though. Play. Create a room. Ooh, we do. Here's a quick guide on how the room screen works. First, you pick a role. Okay. Each role has a unique appearance and unique abilities. Then you must pick a contract. You can choose between three contracts. Each contract is a randomly generated story you have to unravel. Okay. Um, <laughs> we'll do this one for you, Tiffany. It's about a real estate agent who um, thinks the house is haunted. Wanda54, thank you for the follow. Okay, so let's do this one. Okay, I, I approve of my um, I approve of my ghost fighting outfit. I'm okay with that. So unlocks new difficulty grades. Continue. The Exorcist Diary contains useful tips for various ghosts you face. Continue. Here you can set up your room. Okay, I want to, it's now your room, now to work. Okay, so I think I'm going to start with her. So let's pick a contract. We're going to do this one. Let's start. All right, everybody. Let's see how this works out. Let's see how this works out. This is a new game. It's called Remnant. Some, it's, I don't even know what the name of it is. But we're ghost hunting. Okay, so this one. We are on our own. Remnant Records. Yes, thank you so much. Oh, we have. We have a shotgun. So let's put that right here because we might need that for Hazel. Thank you for my roses. I appreciate that. 
Okay, so here's. Okay, let's pick this up and we're going to put this over here because we might need that. Okay, so you have to remember we're ghost hunting, so I have to be. Oh, you like that? Oh, I love Aquaphor spray. I think it is amazing. Wow, we have quite a few prescriptions that we're going to put over here. Because you just never know which ones we're going to need. They do. I use it all the time on my um, healed tattoos just for like an extra super um, pop of moisture and it works great. Okay. What is that? I don't know what that is. Okay, so now the pillows are all over the place. look in the closet let's look in the closet it's a very strange closet those look like oh we have a briefcase okay I'm gonna stop carrying stuff around aren't the emotes cute I love them Aww. I am fall from grace that's awesome well that's a, a gift subscription for one month and then after that, it's $2.99 a month if you want to resubscribe. So it's, I try to keep my, I, I pick the least, no, they won't let me open those up. I pick the least ex, expensive subscription I could. So then that way, hopefully everybody um, will have the opportunity to subscribe. And I appreciate all of you. Okay. This is a strange ball here for some reason. Lots of closets again. Lots of closets. Yeah, you know, it to me I didn't want it. To, I know for myself, I would I would appreciate that, so that's why I did that for for all of you. Okay, here's a pen. Okay, we haven't found any notes yet though. Crazy Llama Cat, I totally get it. I totally get it. Yeah, that's what that's what I'm thinking. Oh, what's this? It's a notebook. So we have a notebook. We have some wine and a beer. Man, they drink a lot in this game. And another closet, just like that. Uh, sure, crazy, crazy llama cat. I mean, so long as it's a TikTok approved, it, I, I mean, it can't be too graphic. Brianna, thank you so much for the follow. That's what I was thinking. If there's a whole lot of drinking in this game, I'm going to return it because I'm not going to sit here and get triggered over um, violent acts and alcohol. Yeah. <gasps> oh, honey, I am so sorry. Well, I am here to support you 100%. And I just want you to know that I love you. And if you, you are here 100%, um, every single day you will have my support. And I... Um, I just wanted to let you know that if there's anything that we can do or I can do, just absolutely let me know. And I'm so sorry that you had to experience that, but I'm glad that you're here and I'm glad that we can support you. It's a lot bigger house. Okay, what is that? 
some beans. Uh oh, I dropped my beans. Hopefully I don't need that. Brad, thank you so much for sending out a subscription. Kitty Cat, you just got a subscription. Brad gifted you a subscription for one month. After that, it's $2.99 a month, and you are subscriber number 1,701. Um... Yeah, honey, we're here for you 100%. I mean, just stop, you know, just come in there. Just, we're here for you. Okay, so that's a remote key. We have some food. I don't see any notes. Oh, here's a note. Let's see if we have anything here. Okay, so it says, police just called me. They said Stanley had a serious accident and I asked to speak to him. The officer paused and I physically felt my heart sink. Is this a bad joke, right? This is one of those things I always had nightmares about, but that would never happen again. One of those things that only happens to others. Stanley, please don't leave me alone. I'm done. This time is the last. I'm done. I can't stand seeing any of your ugly faces anymore. I can't stand seeing your disgusting my smiles. I can't stand hearing your voices. Shut up, shut up. Hmm. I wonder if she's talking to like some ghosts or something. Brad, thank you again for sending out a gift subscription. And Krista, you got a free gift subscription for one month. Um, after that, if you choose to resubscribe, you definitely can. It's $2.99 a month. And congratulations, Krista. You are now have a subscription for a month. Um, Orlando, thank you so much for the follow. Yeah, Kinsey, kind of like, definitely like something. Yes, definitely something like that. So was there anything in this? Because we have to find clues for the haunting or for the possession. And so what I'm thinking like a mirror something like she couldn't stand seeing uh, like if we find like a handheld mirror i think we should probably pick that up oh i think i was able to take up so when we read the notes we have to um, we have to try to figure out if there's something in the notes that we need to look for in the house for when we do the exorcism. And there's that. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, exercise. Yeah, not ex. Did I say exercise? <gasps> uh oh. Look at that. Whoa, whoa. was weird okay we have a Ouija board not too sure if I should do anything with that yes it did say something about smiles so maybe a toothbrush
Oh, because in the... Because here's this bathroom. There's got to be more than this bathroom. I can't pick that mirror up either. So let's look and see, was there another bathroom? No, it's not letting me open up any of that stuff. Nope, it has to, I, the only thing I've been able to open up is the doors themselves. Oh, look at all the tables, the tables and the chair move too. Crazy stuff, crazy stuff. Okay, so let's, go and see if we can't find another bathroom down here. Because there's nothing with the mirrors or anything here. Oh, here's something. Okay. Finally, my custom made spirit board is ready. That one I only bought before was obviously a fake. But just from seeing this one, I feel my spirit connecting with the other side. This is incredible. And then it says, I can't effing believe it. I saw Stanley um, right there with some woman making, um, kissing her. Um, after all I've done for him, I've always been so kind. Um, he ain't going to get out of just like that. So we need to go get that spirit board. Do -do. Yeah, it's called Remnant Records. Thank you, Nadia. That's what I'm thinking. Definitely, that's what I'm thinking. So let's go get that and put that. Oh, hello, excuse me. Oh, I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fighting. Phew. All right, I fought for my life. Um, where was this? Where was this? Okay, let's get this. Ew, ew, ew. Let's put it down here. Ew, ew, ew. Oh. Ew, 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 ew. Okay, so let's put that there. Let's try lighting it and see if we need anything else. Ooh, that is, I think I pissed something off. Oh, it's the right one. So it's the right clue, we just need more. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, okay. So we need to find some more notes so we know what else to put. Try the exercise with a new set of items. Okay. We have that one. Let's see here. if there's anything in here this is called um, resident rem remnant something resident something something hold on let me find out what this is called this is driving me crazy
This is called Remnant Records. Remnant Records. Thank you, Sam the Ham. That's it exactly. That is it exactly. So this one is a notebook, but it won't let me read what's in the notebook. There's no... A kitty cat picture. It seems like I found more things upstairs, so let's go back and look upstairs. Oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, so nothing here. Uh oh. Okay, we keep getting attacked. I've only found those two notes. Only found those two notes and I don't think I know what else to put on there. This is called Re Resident Remnant. Remnant Resident, something like that. I'm not 100% sure about this game yet. I think it has a really cool concept. I'm just not 100% sure I like the content yet, so. <sighs> yeah, I mean, I, I don't know how, m oh, shit, okay, uh-oh, fighting for my life, fighting for my life, fighting for my life, nope, I failed, okay, well, I just bombed my first day at ghost hunting school, <laughs> All right, you guys, with that said, I am going to end my stream for the night. I'm not 100% sure what we are going to be playing tomorrow, but it will be a great one. I know that for sure. Crazy Llama Cat, honey, my heart goes out to you. I am always here for you if you need me. Um, I will be thinking about you, and you will be here a special place in my heart. I love you dearly. Good night, everybody, and I appreciate each and every single one of you. I will be back at 3.30, um, and I, see, here's the thing, Crazy Llama Cat, here's the thing. I will think about you every single day, but I want this to be your place of escape, so if you want to talk about it, you talk about it. If you don't want to talk about it, then we're not going to talk about it, so this I, I just wanted to know that this is your place of just being able to just let things go but if you ever want to talk about it we're here for you all right everybody i love you dearly jen i love you you already know that um it, it and that's just the whole thing crazy it's like it it's it's what we c it's what i can do for you is what i would like to do so it, it's whatever you want you just need to let me know what it is that you need all right i love you very much um and we are supportive beings. Good night, everybody. I love you dearly. I will be back again tomorrow, 3.30. Um, be safe, be warm. I love you all, and I will see you then, I think. I don't know how to leave. There we go. See you tomorrow, I think. All right. I think. Oh, here we go. They make it really hard to leave this game. All right, everybody. I'll see you tomorrow. Love you all. Good night, Elizabeth. Good night.